persona. Alright, and with that, we are live. What's up, everybody? Uh, real quickly, just gonna do my invites here, so give me one second, ladies and gents. Alright, with that, we'll say hello to everybody that's currently here at this time. Uh, hello to App, hello to Zach, and hello to Billy. How is everybody doing this evening? Alright, so, uh, with that being said, welcome everybody to another edition of the Gaming Beatdown here today on November 20th, 2021, as we are here continuing more of game number 212 here for Let's Play Nights, also our second game for Let's Play Nights for season number 11, as we are here with day number 5 of Horizon Zero Dawn. Yes, uh, last time, we basically just continued where we left off on our last cast of the, of the game, we basically, uh, did a lot of side stuff, uh, basically, uh, just to level up Al uh, Aloy and whatnot. Got her, like, some new, uh, abilities, uh, got her some new equipment and all that loveliness. Uh, we did a little bit of some of the, some of the, some of the story as well. Uh, we actually entered a bit of the, uh, the DLC, uh, areas, which is pretty cool. So, just to get, like, all the, uh, the territories or area or map just filled out, really, basically, is kind of what we did. And, uh... 
basically that's what we did. So yeah, so today uh, we're going to pay me to continue either five or six hours of Horizon Zero Dawn, depending on how much I want to do today. Uh, probably we'll be doing some more side stuff as well, like some side quests and stuff like that that there are that do. Uh, we also will be doing some... Uh, uh, that, that one area I want to go and take down that giant like uh, T-Rex mech, uh, mech, basically, in that one little dungeon area. I want to go and do that, because that would be kind of nice to uh, eventually go and do and get that out of the way, because I think that's the only one we have left to do. Um, we'll definitely do some story, and um, we'll basically go from there. So yeah. Um, so yeah, we're, we're kind of getting close to being maybe done the game, I would like to say. Um, obviously there's some stuff I would like to go and try to do a lot here today, especially on the side stuff. Um, we could potentially be doing uh, the DLC eventually here. I mean, it depends how much story I do today as well. Uh, we could be basically maybe only needing maybe like two or three more streams left of this game, maybe. Uh, just really depends. I'm gonna say probably maybe two, maybe. We'll have to wait and see, really. Just like I said, just depends how much we uh, I, I'm gonna be doing here uh, from here on out, right? So I'm gonna try to aim for two more streams following tonight. But if we don't finish it by then, then maybe three. So maybe three for sure, because. Um, it just depends if you guys would also like to see the DLC being done as well. Um, that's just if you guys are interested in seeing it. Um, I can put it in co part of this playthrough as well, because uh, why the hell not, right? Because it, I have I have it for free since this is the complete edition of uh, Horizon. Since uh, yes, I was able to get the uh, the full version for free when Sony was giving it out a few a uh, few months ago. So it came with the whole stuff. So basically, the whole package was available. So. Uh, if those people, if, those, if everyone's interested in me going through it, I will, I will definitely do so. So um, that just depends if everyone's up to it and whatnot. So, um, but we'll most maybe we'll most likely do it. But I, I will do it if people are interested in seeing it. So, but because it looks like it's going to be more of a uh, snowy environment area and whatnot, some new uh, some mechs that we can fight. I, actually, there are some pretty tough ones too. It looks like it's definitely a uh, a post game. Uh, area so once the main game is done then you head over there and do all that stuff there so um, it definitely looks like it could be uh, pretty tough but uh, we'll just have to wait and see when we level up and whatnot because we actually have gotten a lot of levels for sure I think I think we're close to almost being at the level that we need to be uh, for the last mission for the main game so that's good to see so we're pretty close when it comes to that so uh, we just basically just need to keep upgrading our, our weapons and stuff like that. Maybe some armor. If we find some good armor, um, I'll definitely, definitely do that. So, yeah. Um, but, yeah. What's up, Jinjos and Uber as well? Welcome, welcome, everybody. Hopefully, everyone is doing well today on this Saturday. So, yeah. Um, but before we get underway here today, uh, I got to go and run down a little bit of an announcement or just promote an event that's coming to you live here uh, in a few weeks, actually, um, as it's... Uh, going to be a winter marathon yes it's our third annual winter marathon at the beatdown crew live on twitter or not twitter twitch tv uh it's a secondary channel of mine where i host marathons and stuff like that and yes our third annual winter marathon will be happening over there from december 6th to the 12th where me and a bunch of casters will be casting for an entire week for your guilty pleasure as we will be benefiting for the make a wish foundation that's right we actually have a lot of people who have signed up already for it so but we still have plenty of spots um open as well so if you are a streamer if you know someone that is a streamer that would love to participate anyone is a welcome to join it and uh, basically uh, you can uh, DM me either on Twitter uh, discord or through the, uh, the the marathon Twitter account and you can get more information about how to sign up and whatnot there as you can get invited to an exclusive discord server for the marathon and how to sign up there and all that yeah, and whatnot um, registrations will be going until the 5th of December so basically You'll have to register by then, and uh, yeah, just let me know by then. And once again, the marathon comes to you live December 6th to the 12th, 2021, over at Twitch, uh, twitch.tv slash the Beatdown Crew Live. For more information about the marathon as a whole, you can check out our official Twitter account over at the Beatdown Crew over at uh, twitter.com. Yes, yes, yes. So, with that being said, we are good to go, so let us uh, dive in and continue on with some more uh, Horizon Zero Dawn, shall we? Yes, yes. As we picked up right where we left off last time, we actually were doing a, a bit of a story. We actually just finished up a story quest here in the last time and whatnot, so that's kind of what we did. And thank you, Kippy, for the host. I appreciate oh, that. <laughs> and how you doing, Kippy, by the way? So yeah, like I said, we actually got uh, some stuff we need to do here today. Uh, we have a lot of side stuff I gotta do. There's one thing I want to do today. I want to go back over here and take this out because um, there's this giant T-Rex mech I want to take out. And uh, if I can take that out, that'll be pretty huge because uh, we, that means we can uh, 
um, hijack a bunch of these freaking uh, mechs out here. I think we'll be able to hijack all of them, really, so yeah. Uh, there's also this we can take out today, too, so we'll definitely like to get that done. Uh, maybe we'll get these corrupt zones if we can, clear those out, and of course, we'll definitely be doing some story. We obviously just have, like, uh, one quest line up to go, really, right now. I think, if I remember correctly, when I looked up where we're at for the story right now, um... I think we only are, uh, let's see, we're only six main lines, uh, the main game story missions left, basically, so only six of them left to go until the DLC begins and whatnot, so we'll try to do that. Uh, we do have some side stuff here, as you can see right there, uh, maybe we'll definitely get some of those done, some errands maybe, just to get the XP and stuff like that, so... Uh, there's stuff stuff like there, so yeah. Damn, you're at the end of the game already. Uh, c kind of, not really. I mean, kind of, close. But I've kind of been doing a lot of side stuff, too. Plus, there's still the DLC I gotta do. Um, there's, I, there's still that I have, to, I have to tackle, which is about, like, eight hours long and whatnot, so... I still got that to do, so I'm still not done the main game yet, but, um... There is some there is some DLC I still gotta do, too, because if, if people are interested in me doing it, I will definitely, uh, definitely do it. For sure, for sure. Um... Yeah, so to start off, I'm gonna actually, uh, get something here, actually. I think, um, I think I'm going to get, uh, what do I want to do, actually? Disarm traps, combat, knockdown. Ooh, actually, that would be pretty good, actually. You know what? I'm gonna go with that one, actually, because I definitely melee a lot, so I actually, I think that would be very good, actually, so yeah. Um, but yeah. But yeah, I, th I think I'm closer to mostly being done, uh, Metroid Dread than this game, honestly. I Because th I think yesterday during Metroid, we're already at the half... I think we're close to the halfway marker already. So I think I'm closer to done that compared to this game, that's for sure. <laughs> Alright, so I think today, to start off, I might take out this thing, because it's closer, and I think I might take that out so far first, yeah. So is this game... I recommend so far, like something I should. Yeah, if you're in, I I think so. Yeah, it's very very fun. The combat's very fun and whatnot. It's very very fun. There's a lot of stuff you can do in this game. There's like hunting missions. There's like um, side quests and stuff like that. There's the story. There, yeah, it's it's pretty fun. The, the 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 as it goes on, the better it gets. I find, especially with its gameplay. At least I find it. At least. Uh, how do I get down again? I can't remember how to get navigate my way around here. Yeah, I need to finish it. I think I've been told it's pretty short. Yeah, I think. Yeah, that's. I. That's. It is pretty short so far. Cause, I think. What, what did I? What did I get to last night? I think I got up to the point where you get. Um. What what weapon did I get? Or ability? I think it was the. Um, oh shit! What is it? The. Uh, the one where you can like run super fast, right? That's the one I've got. That was the last move I got, which I believe is like around the halfway mark of the game, or it's close to it. We can like charge your, just, you can run super fast and whatnot. So yeah, <laughs> that game is really good, by the way. Even if it is short, it is very, very good. In my opinion, need to get dread still. Yeah, it's pretty good. I think you'll like it if you ever do get around to getting it. I know everyone's been playing Pokemon, because that came out this week. I, I, I got it, but I, unfortunately Amazon's delaying my order. They're not going to get here till Thursday, because it's coming from the other side of the Canada. <laughs> so I have to wait, unfortunately. I, you know what? I don't know how to get out of here. I'm just going to I'm just gonna fast travel. <laughs> I have no idea how to get out of here right now. I'm, just, I'm running in circles. I, I'm going to just warp over here. <laughs> I think I need the stream sometime. Yeah. I actually, I didn't catch your the start of you playing it because I think you, you streamed it twice, right? If I'm pretty sure. You, you got like two streams of it, I think, if I remember. All right, how do I how do I crouch again here? Right, right, right. There we go. There we go. Okay. Um. So right, we need to go that way. We will take out this camp over here, just because. Yeah. Oh, you streamed it once. Oh, okay, okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Just like me, <laughs> basically. I actually got jump scared yesterday while playing it. <laughs> um, I put a uh, I put a clip up on uh, Twitter and uh, in the in the Discord I, where I got jump scared by the uh, by the little robot guys. <laughs> I got fucking terrified. I was like, "Holy shit!" <laughs> it was so scary. He literally camped the door. 
Because <laughs> I thought I shot the door to go into it. No, he opened the door to, to come after me. <laughs> you guys are terrifying. I definitely need this, I'm pretty sure. I definitely, definitely need more of those because uh, my uh, medicine pouch is pretty low. Alright, here is this. Okay. Bandit camp. Alright. Uh, let's see what we're at with our stuff here. We have no explosives! Great! <laughs> Which we probably don't really need because, I don't know. Don't know if I really, really need them. Let's see here. We got a guy right there. I don't see anybody else up there. So if we can take out this guy, that would be pretty nice. Oh damn it! I can't see. I, I I can't I can't see. This bush is this 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 leaf is in my damn face. I can't see. Ooh! All right, nice. Okay. How many goons are there gonna be here? There's a guy right there, actually. Haven't you got anything better to do? We got a stiff over here. No, you don't. He's just gonna stand there. Yeah, he is. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, I thought he was moving. Hold on a second here. No, I can't see. That smoke is in the way. Get out! No, I, th I think it's gonna block it if I go if I try to uh, shoot. Wait for that meter to go down. I think that might be the best strategy. Right, so we got a guy there. Frost always said, "Patience." Okay, 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 okay. okay. What the fuck? Oh, there we go. <laughs> I thought I hit him. Sometimes, like, the airs like to go through. <laughs> For some reason, I don't know why. Just with this game sometimes. Alright. I'm gonna grab all this stuff right here. That was a close one. Oh, I have an idea. Just in case anybody comes over here. We'll put that there. Uh, anything worth in here? No. Alright, doesn't look like anyone's coming over here. At least not yet. Like that. Ooh, that guy's right there. I'll go after that guy. With his big ass club gun thing. First, let's, gotta, let's get their loot. Oh, they have blaze. I need that shit. Oh, is he the boss? Damn it. I can't take him out. I don't have the ability to take him out. Ah, oh, feels bad. Okay, I need to drop some stuff here. Um. What the hell do we get rid of here? Uh, do I have a bunch of trees? Uh, a bit. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna drop that. The only negative thing about this game is its inventory system. Because holy crap, <sighs> you, you uh, there's a lot of a uh, lot of it, and you can't hold a lot of it either. Okay. Um, sticky bomb. <laughs> All right. Hopefully that wasn't super loud. <laughs> Hope I don't hear it too. Okay. Where's the alarm at? Actually, I don't even see. Oh, is that it right there? Oh, yes, it is. Okay. That is it right there. 
Okay. Take him out. Alright. They're giving up. Take that out. Ooh. All right, all right. Nice. Let's finish this. All right. Well, I'm gonna have to do some combat here. Woo! All right, that was sick. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Oh fuck! What the hell hit me there? Oh, I'm stuck on. Oh no 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 no! no that's good. Oh god. Ow. Oh. Need to heal up here. Oh boy. Ooh. There. Oh god damn it. Got her in the corner. She's fucked now. Got her. <laughs> All right. Gonna tear you down. Oh, that's you shooting the fire arrows. All right. Bam. All right. <laughs> Not there. <laughs> there. Oh shit. Oh god. Who? 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 Oh damn. From way over there. Okay. No, I got you. <laughs> All right. Headshots for days. It's the way to win. They are OP in this game. Okay. It's gonna be like that last one I did where it's like... <laughs> they're gonna be hiding somewhere and I can't find them. Alright. Nice. Is there any, uh... Hostages here? Oh, yeah, I think I see them. Right over there, yeah, yeah. Let's help them out. Captives. They're not just cutthroats. Slavers, too. Get you out of there. And get I'm you out get of there. Alright. Now I gotta find the remaining uh, guys here. Oh, oh, oh. Nope. You saw nothing. <laughs> okay. Uh, grab that. Yep. Uh, oh, somebody's so alert over there. And we win! Alright! <laughs> that one was very easy. Just like when I draw a uh, derp on Mario Kart, only people only people see. Yes, like me. I, I catch you. I catch you in 4K every time. <laughs> Alright, we got a uh Did we level up there? Yes we did. We are now level 30, yes, which I believe the last level. Uh, they are the the level um or, or the recommend level for the last mission. The game is level thirty four, uh, so that's cool. So we're like what four mission or four levels off? So that's not too bad. That is pretty good. Um, but I actually really want to take this on. I think I can definitely do it, maybe do it now. Honestly, at this point. Um, but I also do need. Uh, I want to get the thing where I can actually. Um, what is it? To uh, I could actually. Um, what is it? Uh, fast travel without having to craft it every time. That would be nice. Um, what, what do we what do we need for like weapons right at the moment? What do I got? What am I what do I what do I have at the moment that I'm uh, currently using? I got a slingshot. I got a bow, and I got the um, shadow sling. Okay. And what's the other uh, one I'm using? Oh, yeah, the rope caster. Yeah. Okay. Um, what do I need to make the rope caster. Uh, I need a snot my heart. Okay, so that's all I need. I just need a snot my heart, and I can actually make that, which would be very good. But I don't know where I can find snot maws. Let's take a look at the map here for a second. What is a snot ma? 
Uh, stalker. Uh, charger, long leg. Snot ma. Oh, the Mr. Viles. Right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we gotta take out some alligators uh, for that. Uh, I gotta craft a, uh, a thingy of a bobber here. Hold on. Uh, I, need, I need a few of these. Unfortunately. A, a snap mod. Wait now. <laughs> Wait now. Yes. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's open these real quickly. Stuff from these. Ooh, blaze. Ooh, I should probably make. I probably should drop some stuff for that. Uh, let's see. Resources. Resources. Scrats. Let's drop. Um. Drop some rope. We don't really need that. Uh, as for our uh, treasure boxes, there you are. Get that blaze. Cool. And then I can actually not make. Actually, I'm gonna need a bunch of uh, explosive ammo for if I'm gonna fight that thing. Yeah, and I don't have much of it, so I need to be able to like. Um, I'll need to be able to like find something that like, drops a lot of that stuff, so I can actually. Uh, so I can actually uh, fight that dinosaur because he's he's tanky as hell and he does a lot of damage. <laughs> I'm gonna need explosive ammo, and I don't really have much of it right now, which is unfortunate. I need to, I need to uh, grind for some from for some blaze material at the moment. But only if you had enough rupees, yes. <laughs> I actually have those games installed because somebody put them on PC a few months ago, <laughs> so I actually have both games on my PC. So if I ever want to play them. I, I, I could. <laughs> no way, yeah. Yeah, some dude actually put them on PC, and uh, <laughs> I have them installed. So I, I can just play them whenever I want. I, and I've always wanted to, just for the lulls. I'd probably hate myself, but I wanted to do it for the lulls. <laughs> but I just played a Zelda game, though, so I'm going to have to hold off for that for a little bit. Okay, so fire. <gasps> a fox! I also need you. But you don't have what I need, damn it. What the fuck? I missed that entirely, but god I suck. <laughs> Whoa! Okay. Oh god. Holy shit! Da 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 God! <laughs> Take off his armor right there. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, I hit him with one of these. I froze him. Holy shit! Okay, that hurt. That hurt. That hurt. That hurt. That hurt. That hurt. That fucking hurt. Oh fuck! Another one. Fuck. I guess there were two there. Oh fuck. Okay, okay, okay. Also, somebody said please. Not a good time to be saying please because these things are crazy. I don't really have a lot of uh, health packs right now. Oh, there he is right there. I was looking for him. I want to loot. Ah. Oh, God. Oh, God. No.
Get over here. What the fuck? Another one? There's three? Aw, oh, Jesus. Aw, oh, Jesus. Aw, oh, god damn it. It's one too many. I don't need this. This is stressful. Look up the edge of the gun. You know, I have an idea. I'm going to hack one. And then I'm going to make it so it takes out the other ones. Yeah, it's not a bad shotgun. They're 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 fucking off now. Good, good. They're 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 getting out of here. You'll do. Okay, okay. All right, all right. Turn around. All right, all right. Oh, damn it. I got too close. Shit. <laughs> I'm just here chilling and exploring Sinnoh with my pal Teddy the Shinx. <laughs> nice. Pretty pog. Pretty pog. I was gonna do that whenever I got around playing that. <laughs> I was gonna name my Shinx Teddy as well. Tomorrow is Shinx Day. Wait, he has a day? No, I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. Okay. Well, that, I, I, uh, I made a huge mistake. Ah. Excuse me. <laughs> coming, coming through, getting out of the water. No, please. Stop! <laughs> oh, dang it, stop. Ah, uh, can I not actually- oh, I can't. Okay, I actually can't do it like that. That's what I was wanting to do. There we go. Alright, I know you're weak, but you got this, buddy. But now watch this. Alright, here we go. Yeah, let's fucking go. Wait, uh, take him down. I know you're weak, but you got this. Oh, no, he doesn't got this. No, he doesn't got this. He's a little... He's a, he's a little uh, Little not too strong right now. Oh damn, he took him out. That's unfortunate. Well, if he's got a heart in him, I'll take it. He doesn't have a heart in him. Fucking hell. All right. That's unfortunate right there. All right, all right. I have an idea. I'm gonna try and uh, override this one. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> ah! <laughs> alright, hold on. Got it. Alright, 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 alright. Uh, 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 override. Yeah, here we go. Oh god, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming, hurry! Hurry! Ah, no, he's coming! Ah, oh, damn! Oh god! Okay, no, that didn't work. Ah, shit, I'm stuck on a tree. Oh, damn. Another one came. 
for me right there. <laughs> I'm so injured right now, this is not good. <laughs> no. No, I'm good. <laughs> oh, trying to get like around him. Ah, fuck, that's bad. Okay, okay. If I can time this right, I can go and override him. But, not feeling too, uh... He's attacking something over there. Oh, just some random dude just showed up, okay. override this guy. No! I had him and he turned! Fucking damn it! Okay. Damn it. I had him and then he just as soon as I had the button pop up he turned. Damn it. Alright. Try again. Try again here. Do I still have health packs in that? Yeah, a little bit. But not as much. Okay. We can try that again. Uh, where is he? Right here? Yeah. Um, attempt that again here. Yeah, the, the, the hunting in this game is pretty, is pretty epic, I will admit. It is pretty good. <laughs> and I think, I think in the, ne the next game, I think, I don't know how, how legit this is, but... At least, at least from the trailer, and that looks like you can go in the water and swim and hunt in the water and that, which would be pretty cool. I don't know how, how uh, legit that is for sure, but maybe you can. I haven't really seen much of the gameplay. I'll take that away. Oh, that's unfortunate for him. He's stuck on that log. <laughs> Fuck, no, damn it. Here. Ah, damn. Okay, okay, okay. I got it, alright. All I wanted was to override him. There we go. That's what I wanted. Now he can go after them. Yeah! Let's go. Aw, oh, shit, that hurt. Go for the tackle attack. It's too weak. Did he have what I need? He did not. Alright. Oh, he's attacking that thing. Damn, he fucked up that thing. Oh, I have enough for it.
I just want to get this thing's heart. Bodied that guy. There's a lot going on. These guys are fighting over here. This thing's fighting that. <laughs> so much shit going on. This game's nuts, yeah. It's it's pretty nutty. No! How do you miss that? <laughs> it's right there. There we go. <laughs> What's up, Bracer? How's it going? Oh, well, shit, I died. <laughs> Damn it, he's too, he's too strong. He's way too tanky. Uh, damn. He's not dropping his his the heart I'm hoping for. Damn. Uh, I'm gonna look up like how do you, I can get more. Um, what is it? Um, shit. What, what what was that stuff I need? I think it's uh, blaze, right? I think that's what I need. Uh, ammo. Yeah. Uh, yeah. How do you, how do you get blaze in this game? Let's see. Best place to farm for blades. Yeah, I need to. I need to know. Uh. Uh, grazers. Okay. Let's see that. I'll see about that. And thank you, Uber, for the host. I think somebody else hosted there too. I was reading that. Uh, Palin, thank you very much for that. Uh, okay. What? What the hell are grazers? I think I was actually told that that was grazers. What the heck do they? look like what are you what is a grazer hold on I'm gonna look this up here oh the deer looking guys okay these guys yeah 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 Okay, okay. These guys. So these guys apparently have like little canisters on them you can shoot off and uh, they definitely need those. And I think I know what they are. They're those things on the back of them. Yes. I'm pretty sure I know what, they're, what, what I'm looking at here. Okay, so we gotta go this way. Thankfully, these guys aren't as tanky, but I also do need to stock up on, on uh, medicine pouch because I am very low. <laughs> I only have one right there, as you can see. That green bar is my medicine pouch. I need more of that. I have an idea. I'm gonna override this one, and then he's gonna take out his friends, and then I can easily uh, get, get these. No problem. Nice. There's one. There's two. 
Bunch of blaze right there. I'll take that. I'll take that. I'll take all That's of that. Already. Thankfully, I shot off that. It looks like if you take out two blazes of them, they're dead. Which is nice. Makes that very easy to deal with. Where's my guy that I hacked? Oh, he's over there. Uh, we'll see if I need any more. Yeah, I'm gonna definitely need uh, a bit more blaze. It's not gonna be enough, unfortunately. Oh, you're not a, you're not who I'm looking for. You don't need to fight me. Get the fuck out of here! Get the fuck out of here! Okay, I need that. I need that. I need that. Do you have any more on you? Yep, you have one. Okay. Um. Darn, I'm short by one on that. That's unfortunate. So I need more. Okay, where's another, uh... Where's another w one of you? Still over there, hey? Maybe we'll, maybe we'll fast travel and see if it actually, uh... If it loads new ones. See if that will help. Uh, this way. Because that would be nice if they, it respawns them. Cause I uh, could use some, some more. No, it looks like they're still dead. That's unfortunate. <laughs> that didn't work as I thought. Unless is that one over there? No, that's just a tree. That's a over there. A lance horn. Does he got blaze on him? I can't tell. I don't think he does, no. I don't think he's got any there. Oh, uh. useful. Well, I guess I can grab some of this for now, because I need, uh, medicine. <laughs> I got a meter of medicine. Um... I think I will actually also, uh... I will craft another travel pack. Uh, my satch satchel's full. Okay, so I can't. Uh, this could go. I don't have the necessary resources. Oh, I need the ridge wood. Oh, whoops. Okay, give me that then. <laughs> can't drop that then. Um, what else do I need for this? Okay, I do have all that. Okay, um, I'll drop some flowers then, maybe? Uh... Actually, I'll, I'll, I'll disassemble these so I can get some points there. Okay, now I can now I can make some. Okay. Let me fast travel to another one where I can find more of these guys. Right over here. 
perfect. I will head over there. Okay, and then we'll, uh, after these guys. Blew that up later. Okay. Keep thinking those, that one would actually actually give you, uh, help, uh medicine touch too, but it does not. override this first one. Blaze, gonna need that. Right. Oh God. Get rid of that guy, cause he's gonna be a threat. while I'm trying to grab some blaze. Okay, how much we got here? Enough to make that. And then almost enough to make enough fire arrows. You know, I didn't want to use that. Please? Oh yeah, it is. Grab me that. That. Grab that. Okay. Uh. That. I need one more. Okay. Oh shit. All right. We has enough now. Now I just need to restock on uh medicine pouch. Yeah, that means now I have enough for fire arrows and explosive ammo. So that's good. That's pretty huge. Oh, there's more over there. Now I just need to get the, uh... Oh, is that, me is that more right here? Oh, no, that's just wire. Okay, so now I just need to restock my medicine pouch, and then I think I'm going to go and tempt that, uh... That dinosaur again. We're gonna try and fighting him again. Because before we tried a couple casts ago, he was a little too strong for my liking. Uh, but maybe now we have an opportunity to take him out here. And if so, that'll be kind of poggers. I could also actually, uh, craft some, uh, some health here, actually, if I need it. Um, actually. One of those, actually. Those would be pretty good, too. Set a random if he falls down, then I can just 
blow him up. <laughs> Wouldn't be a bad idea. Um, Ugh, the scrapes. It's just that. Missing pouch. Cool. All right, two meter. One more. There's fish in this game. Can I actually shoot the fish? Out of curiosity. Oh, I'm gonna use that. You actually can. Oh wow. Neat. I actually think we could shoot the fish. I actually didn't even know there was fish in this game. <laughs> to be honest. Not very much around here, actually. I'm just noticing. There we go. Now we find some. As I say, now we find. It's all on the on the ledges here. Might need that. Oh, there's some. Uh, just a bit more. Almost, almost there. Need maybe one more. Oh, there it is. All right. Safe for a few minutes, anyway. Oh, dang! There's a bunch of those guys there, actually. You know what? I'll override. <laughs> and now, fucking carnage. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Worst venom. Uh, promoting his movie in Persona 5. You're probably thinking, the fuck are you talking about, Andy? Um, yeah, so, if you didn't know, um, when, when, uh, Perso when Ven the first Venom movie was coming out, um, in Japan, during when the Persona 5 anime was going on or whatever, that's when Venom, the first one, was coming out. And, uh, yeah. It was a very weird collaboration. How do I, how do I know that? Uh, I just randomly found out the other day on like YouTube. Ah, oh, no, I'm in space. Hold up, I need to drop some stuff for for this. This is the inventory system again. Does not let me hold on to a lot of things. <laughs> Freaking hell. I will just drop, I don't know. Let's get this. Let's drop this, I guess. I'd rather have a lot of blaze. All the Persona 6 characters will be voiced by Chris Pratt. Yo, that's so cool.
These guys are running out of the way. <laughs> Should I blame them? Gonna need this. Uh, didn't I kill a few more over here? Well, I thought I did. Oh yeah, he's also voicing Garfield. Yeah, that's right. I guess there's another Garfield movie coming out or something, and uh, I guess he's voicing him. Well, he tried. <laughs> he tried to go after me. Didn't work very well. Yeah, he's he, eventually he'll he'll voice every every streamer here on Twitch. So one day. I won't be able to speak anymore, so then um, Chris Pratt will be voicing me. He'll voice Ash Ketchum in the anime one day, too. Just how it's going to be. Alright, well, I have plenty now, so we should be okay now. Yeah, we're full on stock now. Alright. Well, do we do we attempt fighting it now? I think so. I think we're going to go and attempt uh, this guy again here. I don't know how well this is going to go, but we'll see if we can do it. Yeah, how you doing, App? He will voice Misty as well. Yep. That'll be his uh, defining role. You would think like Stark. Uh, you would think that Star, Star Killer would be it, but no, no, no. It'd be, it'd be Misty from po Pocket Monster. I'm going to need to not to tripwire these things. Alright, get up here. Nice. Ooh. Don't shoot! Okay. See ya! <laughs> Bye! <laughs> Alright, we're going to attempt this dinosaur fight again here. I feel like this time maybe we could do it. But I don't know for sure. <laughs> this will help. We'll have to wait and see on that. Is there any more mushrooms or whatever sitting around? If there is, I'll pick that up. Nope. We got a full medicine pouch, so that's that's good. Our medicine pouch is uh, currently full now, which is good. We got full explosives and such, so that's good. I think if I remember correctly, he's uh, weak to piercing ammo. Should probably maybe heal here. We're going in, and then I'll craft a few more of those. This will be interesting, to say the least. Electric, uh, piercing damage, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a lot of piercing damage that's going to, that's going to 
do a lot of damage to him. Look how big this guy is. He's level 27. I'm only, what, level 30. So this will go either very well or very bad. <laughs> That's your Thunderjaw friend, though? Yeah, well, we ran into him a few casts ago, but I couldn't beat him because I was too low level and such. But we're going to give it another try here. Also, what's up, Max? is going? Alright, this is going to be either go really bad or very good. I don't know if there's an in-between. This is the last one of these we have to take out, too. Oh boy, here we go! And I missed. Right off the bat there. Oh boy, okay. I do like no damage, no surprise. He gets out of that so quickly. Damn. Oh shit. Oh god. Fights out of that so quickly, damn. Oof. I didn't do damage, thankfully. Oh god, where am I? I can barely see. Where am I? I'm stuck behind a wall. Oh boy, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Uh Oh god, yeah, now he's doing this. Oh god. I remember this. Ow. Better. A little too close for my liking. Oh fuck, that hurt.
Okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. So far, so good. Oh, shit. Tail whip. Ooh, I should probably hit those things on the back of them. Those look like they will explode. But I don't really have much of those left, really. <laughs> you look like you're having fun? You have to take it down a T-Rex. <laughs> oh, shit, what the fuck is that? Fuck, that hurt. Oh! Damn, that hurts. Oh, I can't hit him. Oh, I'm stuck behind here. Not fall. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. Oh god, that hurt. That's the one wrong. I didn't want to use that. <laughs> ah. You stay still. Damn it. Broke out of the one. Shit, I'm trying to pick that up. Down, that's down. I need a few more of these. Yeah. Not sure where else I could do critical damage to them. I'm not 100% sure.
place. I'm not entirely sure where else I could hit him. It's gonna do damage to them. There, maybe. Tail. that tail now. Nice. Oh, his head. Top of his head right there. Holy shit. Just kill for it. Yeah, let's go! <laughs> Holy shit, alright, oh, you did it. Oh, damn. You have to, like, slowly take off a lot of his limbs for him to get absolutely annihilated there. Damn. Let's go. Ooh, look at all those metal shards right there. Holy smokes. I have so much currency. <laughs> damn! <laughs> alright, let's go. Alright, what do we got in here? Metal shards again. Damn! <laughs> this thing is loaded on stuff. Let's see up for a second here. Ah, uh, now we can... We can say we have completed all of these. Which is pretty good. I'd have to leave something else behind. Oh, what was that? Was that Blaze? Oh, Echo Shell and Chill Water. Oh, okay. Oh, man. Yeah, that was uh, intense. Oh, you actually could have had a gun against them? Oh, interesting. So if you, so if you shot the, the right thing off, you could actually uh, could have used the machine gun against them. That's interesting. Uh, I can't get that. Okay. Let's go... Uh, what else can we loot from him that dropped here? Oh, uh, this did. Oh, that was the Watcher. All right, mind. Uh, where did he... Where did he fall in particular? Oh, right over there. There he is. So big, I couldn't see him. What else do you have in a. Ooh, ooh, that's a lot of blaze. Okay, um. Let's take a look what we got here. Uh. Modification. We're gonna. Deassemble a lot of these. Yeah, all these green ones. Nice. He had a lot of good stuff on him right there, let me tell ya. And some more blaze, very good. Alright. Forget about traveling light. Uh I'll have to drop some stuff here. Uh let's get rid of That, get rid of that. All right, all right, perfect. Then I can go and uh, 
pick up whatever that other thing was that was there. Yeah, right over here. Uh, there's also, what else could I get rid of here? Let's see. Resource. There's that key, right? Yeah, I could just assemble that for... Do you assemble that for, for stuff? There we go. Okay. Alright, well. Let's override this, and then I can override even more of these mechs. That fight was yes. That that fight was intense. Yes. <laughs> there you go. Information to help me override more machines. Very tanky. Let me tell you, he's a very tanky boy. Got another skill point there. Hell yeah, it's Max P. Zeta overrides available. Thunderjaw, the Rock Barrier, and the Stormbird. Oh, I can actually mod the Stormbird. That is cool. Deadlier and deadlier year by year. Why? And what? Who is Hephaestus? Another mystery to add to the list. All right. So I think that was all of those. I'm pretty sure, right? Yeah, I think that was the last one of those that we had to do. So that's cool. Basically, all there is is just these side stuff over that in the DLC there, but yeah. Uh, and then there's the hunting stuff as well. Um, other than that, I don't know what else there really is there. Um, I could do, I guess, the side objective. At least go do this for now. For the main story here. Did you get a skill point? Um... Where's this at? Uh, all the way over here. All right, yeah, I'll go. I'll go here. I guess <laughs> we'll go do some side uh, side missions for now, and then I I eventually will get to the story. Okay, uh, where is this guy? He's over there. All right, all right. Oh, actually, you know what I could do? Actually, I actually could check if I could upgrade anything on here. Uh, not handling, unfortunately. Damage coil, no. Can't do much with that. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, where's it? Oh, right here. It's so bittersweet. It's this guy again. Smile for bloody teeth. What's the matter? You look disappointed. <sighs> oh, the bandit plans are gone. I hear another turned back at the southern plains. Just at a sniff of the legend we carved. That's what all this bloodshed was for, to end the bandit threat. But now there's nothing left to kill. Unless... No, no. I guess this is our last farewell. After all we've been through, this isn't the place for that. There's a mesa south of Meridian with a view of the spear shafts. Meet me there. Okay. Talk to him. Okay. He's right there, though. <laughs> I could just talk to him right here, but... No, we have to walk all the way over there. <laughs> Alright, fair enough, then. I will. Hardy little plant. Grab Welcome. all this loot. Lots of uh, healing items over here. Alright. Uh, medicine pouch stuff here, which I appreciate. Never know when I might need these. Uh, which we're going this way. Okay. 
We have a bit of a run to do here, it looks like. A little bit of a run. The uh, checkpoint save here. any uh, any threats out here at least for now <laughs> there doesn't seem to be oh is he way up here yeah Gotta do some Assassin's Creeding, aka climbing and climbing and climbing. It's quiet, too quiet. I know. I, 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 I'm not used to no, no mechs just walking around around where I am. Something doesn't feel right. <laughs> Ooh, purple. For the trail. Ooh. What's the metal flower? Hey. Worth it, worth it. Lots of loot here. This guy probably took them all out. This'll help. Ooh, that has there's blaze. Ooh, I need that. Um Let's see. Those. Let me just quickly uh craft some more. Metal shards. Some more medicine pouch. Ooh, 19%. Nice. Saving these for the trail. That's pretty decent. And then probably a bunch of stuff I could just make into metal shards. Alright, anyway. No. I did wonder on my way here. Well, if you were luring me into an ambush. Where's the fun in that? Some bandit sprawl would never have done for our arena. But this, much better. There's a sense of drama. So, what do you say? How about we try to kill each other? What? <laughs> Wait. You brought me out here to ask if I want to fight you? To the death. We'll savor it, because we only get this one time. Actually, I don't know what else I expected. Do we accept the duel or do we decline the duel, chat? What do you think we should do? Should we fight this goof? <laughs> or should we be like, nah. <laughs> we ain't gonna fight this guy. Who, what do you think we should do? Should we fight him or nah? He probably gives good XP if I beat him too. I mean, he's asking for it. True, he is asking for it. You know what? That's a good point. He is he wants me to fight him. If this is how it has to end, Nil. Everything does. Only you are so conscientious. I wouldn't want to push you into something that wasn't genuine. Especially death. There's nothing more genuine. That's very thoughtful of you. Hmm? Let's finish this. Alright. Let's go. Get him with that. Ow. Let's see. Oh, can I not stick him? Oh, that's unfortunate. Ooh! <laughs> A 
Yeah, I'll light him on fire. Oh my god! <laughs> Hold on. And I win. <laughs> Winner is me. Oh, don't look so concerned. I should say, I always knew it would end this way. Since we first met. But if I'm honest, I thought I could take you. You cannot. I am the main character. <laughs> you know, I thought this was supposed to be tough. Yeah, me too. <laughs> it was very easy. All right, we did it, and I will loot him. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see what else else he's got here. Um, what else can I get rid of here? I don't really need. Uh. Not much, really. I actually need all this stuff, it seems. Eh, I'll, I'll just see him, because I only have one of that, so I might as well. There we go. <laughs> I don't know if you should let your opponent choose the battlefield. Well, I mean, I did, and it didn't really pay off for me, unfortunately. <laughs> that's what's up late here. How's it going? Alright, so that's done. That's another side quest in the book. We're close to being leveled up again here. I'll be doing another side quest here just to go and do that. Uh, I'll do this one next, I guess. Uh, we gotta go over here. All right. Uh, go over here. Do all these little side quests we got here, and then I probably will go do the story for a little bit. That tried to kill our son King? Traitor, the whole all right. Uh, this way, yeah. Yeah, this is it on the other side? Way. Yeah, it is. Okay. Um, need to figure out a way to get over there. The fastest way, probably. I'm gonna say this way. Yeah, let's go this way. I will go around this way. Oh, just kidding. I can't go that way. <laughs> it looked like I could. Well, I hope this doesn't damage me too much. That, that actually hurt a lot. Okay, maybe I should have done that. <laughs> examine the mount, examine the explosives. Alright, I will. Something's shaking. Breakers make these mounds when they attack. Something coming. What the fuck? <laughs> what the hell are you? What on the nani was that? What the hell are you? Oh, I missed what that said. A rock breaker, alright. <laughs> it's the sand whale from Breath of the Wild, yeah. I mean, yeah. Never mind. <laughs> what I was trying to do, I was trying to bail him to the explosives, but yeah, it didn't work as it didn't work as I had had planned. Oh, I'm just here to take this. What is he weak to? Is that snow? I think it's, I think it's like that, yeah. Ah. Damn, that's hard to get away from.
him in the stomach. Holy fuck! <laughs> that was an ouchy ouch. Dude is lit! Oh, what the fuck? He's shooting rocks! Ooh, baby, okay. Alright, calm down. Let's let's all calm down. Oh! God. Okay, I deal. We're gonna tie him down. Oh, I have no more. No more. Hold on. There we go. Damn it, he got away. Hold up, hold up. Nice, he was right by that. Whoa! Okay, okay, okay. Back up, back up. Setting off. Holy shit, holy shit, holy shit. No, 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 I need more arrows. Okay. We took a bit of damage right there. Look out! No. Ow. Oh god. Oh my god. That hurt. Yeah, let's go, baby. Nice. <laughs> Took him out. Alright, ooh, stealth weave and a corruption coil. Ooh, not bad. There's some good stuff in here. I need to get that. Hold on. Let me, uh... Let me, uh, drop something here. In my, uh, resources here. Let's get rid of, uh... One of these, I guess. I only have one on that. There we go. Very nice. That was a fight, that's for sure. I was actually was not anticipating that. <laughs> so it was very satisfying to win that. Oh, I need more of those, those things there. I have the blaze, just don't have the other stuff now. seen a machine like that whoa nor a hunter so bold take this it's from the quarry stores but no one's gonna argue that you don't deserve it may you walk in the light friend especially when dealing with what comes up from the ground all right <laughs> very nice Ooh, we got a reward box more XP gotta love it all right, um, we got another skill point here, so we, now we can get something else here. Uh, leader Strike. Gonna be a bad one to get. Strong Strike Plus would be pretty good, too. Uh, I 
think I'm going to go with, uh... Gonna go with uh, leader strike, I think, first. All right, nice. So that quest is done. Uh, let's go do. Find a use for the power cell. Let's go do that one. Uh, where do we have to go? All the way back over here, hey? All right. Uh, oh, I don't have a power. Up pouch here. Do I, do I, uh, can I make one? Nah, I don't have any bony meat. Unfortunate. <laughs> well, I'm gonna have to go find something to mount right over here. Perfect. This isn't up to their usual standard. Unless I can find a, a wild animal out here that I can, uh, kill. Oh, like that. Perfect. Maybe they have, uh, I'm looking for. Uh, I don't think that's what I needed. No, I need bony meat. Yeah, I'll have that. I unfortunately do not own the bony meat. <laughs> so much sand, I know. It's, isn't it wonderful? This game's got everything. It's got sand, it's got... No, it's got, uh, it's got, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, rainforest, it's got cities, it's got everything. What else could you want in a game like this? Where you can, uh, go and, uh, explore to your, I mean, uh, go and, uh, EXPLORE! Ah, uh, to your heart's content. Giant metal dinosaurs? Yeah, that too. Got those as well. Alright, so I have to travel for a little bit here because I don't have... ...the stuff I need to make a fast travel kit. I need a bony meat, which I don't have it anymore at the moment because my inventory space is ass and I need more. <laughs> Whoa, jeez! Alright, let's calm down here. We don't need to... Jump off and fly off the map. <laughs> this is a baseball. Uh, wow, I can't believe I discovered this game recently. I ended up beating it an hour, an hour ago, and, and what a crazy story. <laughs> yeah, I've been enjoying this too. This game has been pretty fun. I kind of just been doing some side stuff at the moment, but I'm probably going to do story again in a little bit. And there's a second one coming out in February. Yeah, yeah. That's, yeah, I keep forgetting that's coming up pretty soon, actually. I keep thinking it's, it's like, a few months still. But no, that's it's actually February. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. What the heck is that? Oh, oh it's these, those guys, those guys. Yeah, yeah, I fought this before. Maybe if I'm lucky, I can find a, uh... If I'm lucky, I can find some some sort of wildlife creature here so I can actually uh, get bony meat off them so then I can make a fast travel kit. Yeah, yeah, indeed. I'm actually playing this on PS5 at the moment, and it's it's got a uh, PS5 update, so the load times are pretty quick, which is nice. Still, still like, minor loading screens, but they're, they're pretty fast. Which I, I assume would probably be just the same like when the, when the sequel comes out, since that'll be made for the PS5. Even though I think it's also going to be on PS4 as well, actually, if I'm correct. Ooh, yeah, we can actually mod those bird guys there. We have that ability to do that. Oh, 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 fox! 
Okay, maybe he's got what I need. He's got bony meat. Nice, nice, nice. All right, I, I needed that. Okay, cool. Uh, let's see. What what do we have last stuff that we can get rid of? Probably that. Let's get rid of that. All right. Okay, now I can make uh, I can make a fast travel kit here. My f satchel's full. Damn it. All right. Um, I guess we'll uh, assemble that. Now I can make that. Okay, cool. All right, now we'll go and fast travel all the way over here again. Actually, let me let's get on my mount here. Maybe we can bring him along, just in case I need him. Uh, and then we'll go right here, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, same. I did, dude. It's not as fast, not as fast as it could be, but I think it'll be a bit faster for the next game. Yeah, yeah. For sure, for sure. I'm so glad this game was free uh, a few months ago. Like Sony, like gave away like this game for free, and it was the entire thing. I, to my surprise, it was the DLC as well, which was super cool. So it's like the, everything came with it. Just so nice. That's kind of how I've been able to play this. Ugh, not quick enough. I didn't want to fight that thing, but whatever. Just trying to get around. That. Ugh. Well, I guess I'll have to fight them. Yeah. Ooh, he had blaze, nice. Uh, I still have enough of that stuff I need, but I will make more fire arrows to max out my inventory for that throw I have. Uh, shoot. Or do I have to actually... Oh, I think I gotta actually, uh... Look around here. Okay. Find a use for your power saw. Okay. There's gotta be something around here. What could we use it for? Easier when I was a kid. Oh. So this is over here, actually. Oh. Guess I was still a little off, I guess? Okay. Actually, you're here. Oh, now I don't want to use that. Get more meat. Oh wait, no, it's over here. It is over here, okay. And there's the rain. What are we looking at here? Oh, is there... Oh, interesting. Maybe it's this this thing here. These are helpful. Bitter though. Oh, can I not climb up here? 
Oh, maybe I can. There we go, yeah. Where is this cave? Oh. I wonder what's down here. Maybe I can just go down. Okay. Safe to Trump down there? I'm gonna say yes. Okay, yes, okay. <laughs> I thought to tell if there was water down there or not. I thought that was just the just just the hole. Ooh, nice. Is there a question waiting for an answer? This isn't a cave. It's a room. Ooh. Red light. I'm not getting in. A holographic interface. I think the old ones use numbers like this to indicate time. Uh, hollow lock. Okay. of the old ones. But how do I get to it? There's armor in there. Whoa. Uh. These devices are missing power cells. I'll have to find power cells to get these to work. Need to slot in one more. This too. It's some kind of code. Maybe there's a clue nearby. Okay. One thousand two hundred, fifteen thousand, eighteen thousand, two thousand one hundred. Zero zero zero. One, two, three, okay. information nearby. Looks like each dial has four position. Um, maybe if I get each dial in the right position. Don't know if this number here has anything to do. Let's see. Uh, secure encryption port with holographic data shows required settings to for nearby hollow locks. Hmm. Is there anything else sitting around? Eleven, how's it going? So I guess I had all of them. That's interesting. Actually, I got all the uh, the, the uh, these power cells. That's interesting. I didn't think I got them all. That's kind of crazy. What does this mean exactly? Uh, that's what I'm trying to figure. What the heck do these mean? Two hundred, fifteen thousand, eight, one thousand eight hundred, two thousand one hundred, and zero 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 zero.
Hmm. It's going, it's going. Just playing more uh, Horizon. And I was just trying to figure out what, how to unlock this code here. Or, or figure out this code. More on the other side there. Mm, I don't think so. No, I think it's just those. Okay. I'm guessing these are based on like time. Okay, okay, there we go. Investigate the bunker. Those clamps have the armor locked in place. Maybe there's a way to power up the mechanism, release the clamps. Okay. He's got really intense out of nowhere. <laughs> We need uh, some of that stuff that's in there. Let's uh, craft a few of the stuff away, like this thing. And this one. Gather three power cells. These numbers. They must be related to segments of a circle. Okay, interesting. So we do not have them all. Okay, I thought maybe we did have them all. Oh, interesting. Okay. So I'm missing two power cells then, it looks like. Okay. Interesting. Ultra weave armor. Experimental personal armor. Nanofiber. Construction with bound microphone. Interesting. So I just need to find those last two then, it looks like. Okay. Interesting. So there's two of them I am missing. Or, well, technically three, I guess, technically. That armor helps a lot. Okay, maybe, maybe we'll go look for it. Maybe we'll go look for it. I think maybe we'll try to go grab that. I just need to find out where these other power cells are, though. So I guess I didn't get them all. Like I thought. Uh, now how do we get out of here now, actually? If I can even... Oh, right here. <laughs> the lighting didn't really help me see that. <laughs> that nags him out. It's a peck, then that's a gun. Okay. okay. Well, I'd have to go and look for these then. I, that, and I don't think they're going to tell me exactly where those are. 
So I'd have to look around for them, or use a guide uh, to find the remaining ones I'm looking for. Because I recall I'd gotten two, and two of them were in the middle of a story, or in a couple story mission areas, I remember. Um, so I'd have, I would have to find where these, uh, uh, find where these are, protect potentially. I thank you, uh, Curse for the host. I appreciate that. Okay, so maybe, uh, maybe I'll look that up here. Just to see where I can find them, or just to get, keep me on the right track here. Okay. So, according to one, there should be one over here, which I was here, but I must have missed it, apparently. Okay. Um, alright. We can actually head over there. I kind of want to get that armor. That seems like, it, like, if everyone, everyone, if, if, if it is very helpful, then I will definitely get it. Red light. Oh, shit. Oops. Do you mean to go right into to battling right there? But it's fine. This guy got me. Which way are we going here? Uh, so okay. Trust me, you'll love it. All right, cool. Yeah, I will probably go for it then. I want to get this army before I continue the story, because like I said, we only have like, I think six st main story missions left, so I'm kind of just doing a lot of side stuff today before I do that, because after the main story is done, it's just the, the DLC story stuff, and that's it, really, so. Uh, so I gotta go south here. We will be back for these. For this, because I, I would like to get this. We'll make that our mission right now. It isn't that long either? Okay, that's good. Ooh, actually, do you have... <laughs> because if you do, then I'm just gonna use you as a fast travel. That'll keep my stomach quiet. Let's see, can I make... that? Yeah, I can. I just need to make get rid of something here. Can we get rid of maybe this actually? Yeah, uh, no, I'll get rid of this. Where are you? Here. Okay. Uh... Oh yeah, damn it! I just made my satchel full again. Probably the only negative thing I have in this game is definitely the <laughs> your uh, inventory system. It's not the best, I don't think. It um, takes forever. No, because I the fox will never drop the thing I need. I I I I, I have the other stuff. Just the fox will not drop the thing I need for it. So I know how to make it. Just the fox just won't drop the thing I need from him. I think it's like his skin or something like that, and he will not. Let he will not drop it for whatever reason. I've I've gone out after like so many foxes, and they don't want to drop what I need for it. And I saw a place where I can get it too. It just it just does not want me to get it for whatever reason. <laughs> My RNG is just not work not there right now with this fox. <laughs> Which, sadly, I've been told, like, you just kind of just gotta hope you run into them, sadly. Which, yeah, it's unfortunate. There's not, like, a specific area where they are. You kind of just have to just hope you run into them and hope they drop it. Because, yeah, I think I needed that and, like, a number of metal shards or something like that. Or something around the lines of that. So I do have the other stuff. Just the fox will, just will not give me what I want. <laughs> I'm like the Batista meme. Give me what I want! <laughs> But he won't give me what I want. Oh, there's a fox! Oh my god, fucking fine. I think that's what I need. I think I need the fox bone if I think. I think it's that, if I'm correct. So, 
Maybe we finally have what we need. After all this time. Okay. So the first of these things are here. Apparently I gotta look for like a wall I can break, which I didn't know you can actually do this actually. So this is going to be new to me. It's a breakable wall around here. Right here, I think. It's either that or it's another one. Here we go. That's the one you can break. There we go. Okay. There we go. Or at least one of them. Maybe it's not this one. Not in there. Uh, or, go that way. I might be going in circles at the moment. Or maybe I gotta go this way. There it is. Good. Another power cell. If I find more, I should be able to get to that ancient armor I found. All right. There's one of them. Okay, that's off the table. Uh. Um, let's see. Let's see what's another one I didn't get. So that was that was one I know for sure. Uh, another one is back at Mother's Watch. Yeah, I think I might have missed that one. I'm pretty sure. Let's check what else is in here. Before I go, because there could be some... Some other things, maybe? I don't think so. I think we're good. Pretty sure I got everything. Figure out how to get out of here now. <laughs> All right, here. Yeah, I think. I think. Or 
Was it the right? I have no idea. <laughs> Area starts looking the same. After a while. Here we go. Okay, there we go. There's the way out. Alright. Anyway, now, I gotta go to Mother's Watch, which was... Right... Here, yes. So let's just go there. That'll be the second of three, and then after that I'll have to... Look, look around here. I don't know what the, the third one was. So I believe I missed this one too. Should dismount. I get enough strange looks as it is. Oh, can I not get back in? Oh, can I not get back in? Am I locked out? I hope not. That would suck. Can't I go in? Uh, am I, I, I might be locked out. How do we get back in? Cause that was the that was the entrance right there, was it not? I'm pretty sure. I should be able to get back in. Why is it locked then? Is there another entrance here or something? That I'm not aware of. I don't recall it being closed before. Why is it out of nowhere just closed? I'd have to ditch something. Why are we locked in randomly here? Hold on, let's see. I'm gonna look this up too. The gates are locked at Mother's Watch. Okay, here we go. Try this video and look for, look for a workaround. Okay, let's see. This person's locked out too. Okay, so it's not just me. All right, so I'm glad I'm not the only one. Is there another entrance? I have to glitch the game to get back in. Oh boy, that's going to be fun. Oh, good! <laughs> this should be fun. Okay. Great! So I got to, uh, I'm gonna have to try to get around with, the, like, glitching the game. That's cool. Apparently, I have to be able to, like, get my mount up on one of these here so that I can actually walk in around. 
his ally for whatever the ally for whatever he doesn't want off. Just like that. <laughs> I have to do that. It, but your mount can't walk in here. Yep, my mount literally walked in here. <laughs> Going down fast. Uh oh. Hold up. Why can't I get down? What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Why can't we get down now? Excuse me? Excuse me? Oh, there we go. I think. No? What the fuck? Get me down here. I don't want to be up here. Yeah. <laughs> Let me down. Uh, why is there invisible walls here? What the fuck? Yo, that's bullshit. Let me down. You, 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 you have power cell here in this place. All done. Just cold and wet now. In this freaking place, which. Gives you the best probably potential armor in the game, and 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 you glitch and, and you lock the door. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's gotta be that way in. Hold on, I'll figure it out. Invisible wall. <laughs> that makes no sense. Hmm. Hold up. Hold up. I'm gonna see where he, which way he went, up here. Okay. So I think this is where he, uh, this is where he's heading to right now. Think. Oh, do I have to go higher? made that. So let's see where if I'm in the right area here. in something here, like around here. Not sure where, what he fell through. Hold on, hold on. Where was that? It was like a little area he clipped into. No, I think I might be stuck. Uh oh, I might be stuck. Why is this? 
fucked off. <sighs> Makes no sense. Oh, oh. Oh. I did it. Oh, I got it. Okay, okay, okay. I did it. Okay. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay. Okay, where are we looking for in here? Where is this place? What the fuck, man? <laughs> Why is that locked off like that? That's so stupid. Okay. Where am I looking for here? There's a room in here that has it. space when you literally have to do a glitch the game to break a side do a side goes I know right like why the hell is that even locked off like that what the heck <laughs> that doesn't make any sense why is it locked off Hey! I only need one more to get to that ancient armor. Okay, there's the other power cell. Now the question is, will I be able to get out of here now? Is the question. That that's hope. Okay, I can. All right, I do have enough, thankfully. Oh, that would have been bad. Okay. Gonna get rid of uh, this fish. Okay, and now um, I'm going to fast travel to the next one here. Right. So I got that one. Pretty sure I got that one. It's over there. Okay, so I haven't gotten there yet, so we're gonna go and probably explore this little area over here, because there's something over here. So that's that's where the other one is. That I've not gotten. That's the last one we need. But I'll have to go walk over there, unfortunately, because I've not been there yet. What's up, Chris? How's it going? Hello, everyone from the land of lurking. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> if you have what I need, just make sure. I'll take the bad meat, though. I'm pretty sure I got what I need for that. Just now I just need to make the thing so I can fast travel as much as I want. But now we have to run over there by foot because I don't think I have... Anything over here that can give me a mount. Run! <laughs> Campsite found. Okay, that's good. Wow, well, looks like there's a lot of foxes over here. Ooh, he's got something blue. Fox skin. That's what we need for the the fast travel thing. Yes, that's what we need. Help! I don't want to die away from Meridian. Where are you? A trampler. Well, I'm not gonna fight you, but see you later. Doing better, doing better than a couple days ago. Uh, how about you? Not bad, not bad. I can't complain! Oh, Jesus! 
trying to do a side quest in this game, which apparently gives you like pretty good armor. So I'm just trying to get the last thing of it. Had to glitch the game in order to get this one. And that was fun. <laughs> Uh, this other one, so that 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 process is done. Looks good. Fire discovered. Okay. Uh, nothing close, really, that I can do to to mount, unfortunately, at the moment. I have to fortunately run over there, which is too bad. I think once we get this thing, we'll, uh... we'll just fast shout up. That ruins. Ways away. Yeah, hopefully everything is well. Sorry about uh, if you weren't doing well a couple days ago. Hopefully everything's better or getting better. Cyclist over there. Interesting, interesting. They must be awesome. They've put their stamp on this place. There's another uh, fire pit there, aka a fast travel. Uh, which way do I gotta go here? Oh, down this way. Else. Apparently, I think. Great, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, I am going the right way. Need them soon enough. If only there was some sort of. Oh, actually, there is. I think I can mount these guys. Almost there now. Yeah, I can. Awesome. Whew. Thank goodness. <laughs> Cause I didn't want to have to run on foot all the way over there. Cause that would have been annoying. Oh, I think that's the, uh, the flying guy. Yeah, he is. Damn it. Everything is better? That's good, that's good. That's good to hear. Okay, which way are we going? That way. Oh, whoops, I'm going the wrong way. What the fuck? Hold on a second here. I followed the wrong thing. Whoopsie. Fast travel that, and then make sure I go the right way this time. I went the entirely the wrong way there. Silly me. Okay. Which way are we going? This way. I need this.
guess this way could work. I think. Maybe. <laughs> Not the most ideal way of getting around here, but uh, whatever works, I guess. Uh, can I can I get that? Thank you. Keep, 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 keep going. Keep, keep going. The can't find its footing on these slopes. Keep, keep going. Keep going. Yeah, there you go. All right. Can you jump across this? No. <laughs> he cannot. <laughs> all right, all right. There we go. Okay, I think I think I got up this path here now. Yeah, yeah. There we go. I think I think we're on the right way now. Yeah, yeah. What are they doing all the way up here? Alright, I am going the right way now, thankfully. <laughs> huh. But it seems like we have a lot to take care of on the way there, it looks like. It's not going to be easy to get over there. I alerted one. over there and a bird oh good lots of deadly creatures up here I'm just gonna haul ass and run <laughs> 
It worked last time. Let's do it again. Whoa! <gasps> oh god! Uh. I actually don't know which way I guess I'm supposed to go. Oh god. This way, I guess. This way. Excuse me. Poor Poomba. Into your business. Ah. Uh. Not that way. Oh God. Oh God. There's so many of them. <laughs> Oh god! Uh, oh Jesus! Uh, 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 uh. Okay, okay. Not that way. I don't know which way I gotta go. I actually don't know. What's up, Rabbit? How's it going? There's another path there's gotta take here. Which way do I gotta go? Oh, there's a path right there. Okay. Oh god. Dude, not too bad. Not too bad. Uh, let's see. Okay, yeah, the path's right here. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> oh, right here. Right here. There it is. That's where I gotta go. Grab that. All right. Go. 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 Everybody, go. Let's go. Oh god. Okay, 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 <laughs> okay, okay, um, um, uh, right here, all right, yeah, 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 go, 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 <laughs> all right, all right, uh, right here, all right, all right, I think we're good. How goes the game? It's going pretty well. Here they come. All right, I've made it. Okay, I was lost for a minute, but I figured out where I gotta go. Oh, good! Okay, uh... What level are you? 27, okay, you're tough. Okay, uh... I'm gonna head over here. What I'm looking for is just over here, I think it says. Ah! Am I getting wrecked? Sometimes. <laughs> there it is. That's what I'm looking for. Right there. Ah. Right there. That is that is the where we gotta be. Okay, okay. Uh, this way. Okay. I'm here. I'm where I need to be. I just gotta get in. Oh, I thought she was gonna miss that. I was like, how'd you miss that? No, I've actually never played this before. This is actually my first time going through it. That thought got dark. Uh, oh, where are we gonna go now? Um. Uh. Hmm. 
here, maybe? Wait. Uh... Where does this take me, exactly? up here but I don't see the next climbable area there's there's a okay there's an area up above here but how do we climb up that way Assuming I gotta get up on this area here, that, that's what I'm guessing at least. I am kind of not sure exactly because I don't know where this is supposed to t take me next. Because it takes me here. Is there another one I'm missing? Mm, no. Unless I went too high? This is not actually the entrance. Missing something here. I feel like I am missing somewhere to go here. I get there into this cave. I don't know where they want me to go from here. If this is the way to go. This is the only place I think I can go. There should be something to climb like right here, and then you can get up there, but no. That's not the case. Am I just not allowed to be up here right now? I see purple light up there, so I feel like that's where I gotta be. Like right up there, but I don't know how to get in there.
in particular. I feel like I'm miss I I feel like I'm missing something here. When the uh you, when you get it uh, when you can get it during or after the mission when that when uh, the mountain that fell. Have I done that? Maybe no, maybe maybe that's why. Maybe I haven't done the story mission, maybe. Give me a second here, let me see. Maybe I just haven't done the story mission. Ah, yes, okay. So, it looks like I can't get it right now because I haven't done the story mission. Interesting. Okay. Well, that explains my... Explains it then. Alright then. I can't do it because, well, I, uh... I have not done the story missions to do it then. That is fair, fair enough, I guess. Alright. So I, I'd have to do some uh, some story missions for now. Because it looks like it's not for a little while, <laughs> too, unfortunately, which is too bad. It's like the second to last mission, too, in order to get it, too. Kill the bird? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Because according to this, it says I have to do the, mi the story mission before I can go and get that. Whoa, what the heck? Oh, oh, I was like, why, why am I there? So I, I have to kill the bird in order to get that? Okay. I was just saying kill, uh, I was just saying kill it just to do it. Oh, 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 okay, okay. <laughs> I get you, I get you. I thought you actually had to do it, so if that was the case, and yeah, I was gonna head back there, but if that's not the case, okay, then I know. I'll come back then, because yeah, we, I guess we need to do some story missions in order to do that, so yeah. Which I think I will do those uh, after the break here. So yeah, so when we come back, uh, I think we're going to do some story missions when I come back here. So yeah, so stay tuned as uh, more Horizon Zero Dawn continues when we come back. So if you're heading out, uh, thank you for watching. If you're sticking around, stay tuned as uh, yeah, we'll continue more when I uh, come back. So yeah, so stay tuned. So for the meantime, here is Intermission. We'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. Uh, stay tuned for more. Welcome to Intermission. Wrong button.
Okay, and yeah, with that, we are back live here on the Game of Begin with day number five of game number 212 here for Let's Play Nights. We are here with day five of uh, Horizon Zero Dawn. Yes, we were just doing some side stuff uh, for the first half of the cast, uh, but now for the, some of the side stuff I, I want to do, I unfortunately have to go do more of the story. So we're gonna actually going to go and work on the story here and um, try to get what we need to get up to until we can get... Uh, this certain thing I need to get. So yeah, um, but yeah, hope you've been enjoying the cast so far tonight. And if you're joining us, welcome to the stream. I'm Andy. Welcome to the gaming be done a let's play casual multiplayer stream live Thursdays, Fridays, Saturdays, Sundays, and Monday nights at 7 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Mountain, 9 p.m. Central, 10 p.m. Eastern. It's here today on our Saturday night block, which is known as Let's Play Nights, as we're currently playing our slot two game for Let's Play Nights, which is Horizon Zero Dawn. And this game we put every slot two nights on the channel until we basically complete it here on the stream. So yeah. Um, and just so you know, the next stream after tonight, uh, the next stream comes to you live here uh, tomorrow night with week 193 of Market Deluxe from Mario Kart Sunday. So if you have that, come on by as we play Market Deluxe with you, the viewers like you. On Monday, November 22nd, will be more TGB Sports, continuing my Road to the Show playthrough and Emily the Show 21. Finishing up my first year in the minor leagues, so potentially we could be moving up to the major leagues pretty soon, so that'll look something to look, for, look forward to pretty soon if that happens. Uh, late Night Beatdowns, November 25th. We'll be here with Super Animal Royale with a viewer's choice game that you guys get to vote for when the website updates during the week, so I'll definitely look forward to that. Day 2 of Metroid Dread continues on Friday, November 26th, so we'll uh, continue where we left off on that, so either we'll either finish it or we'll need one more stream to finish it after that, so uh, we'll find out on that. And then more Horizon will continue on next Saturday after tonight's stream, so we'll pick up where we left off here tonight. So if you join us tonight, definitely come on by next Saturday as we'll do it again on that stream there. So yeah, and uh, that's what's coming up here next couple weeks on the channel. All starting to schedule start times are here on the screen, so to see that for that. If anything does change, I'll let me know my social media and Discord, and check my full schedule here on Twitch. You can check that out at thegamingbeatdown.weebly.com/schedule. And by the way. If you are new and you've been enjoying it so far tonight, uh, make sure to follow the channel by clicking the follow button found up above, down below, wherever it is for you. And uh, if you like to update my life, you're on Twitch, you can follow me on social media such as Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, Steam, Discord, or my website over at thegamebeatdown.weebly.com. I all my from the top of the screen right up here, down below in the description, down below to the chat to the side. I'll be spent by beatdown bot, depending on you watching the live streams or the archive. Yes, yes. So, yes, with that, let's uh, continue on here with some more uh, Horizon Zero Dawn, shall we? Yes, uh, we're going to have to go do some story missions for now. So, well, I guess what we'll go and do. So, uh, let me just go and take a look here on uh, where we got to go here. So, we got to go all the way over here, hey? Okay, sounds sounds good to me. Uh, what is this here? Banuk figure. Interesting. Okay. Uh... Oh, you know what? I'm gonna head over here real quickly because maybe I can actually make my uh, what should I call it? My uh, my fast travel kit thing that I that I need. Oh, you know what? I need. I also need fatty meat. Actually, yeah, yeah. Let me go and uh, hunt some animals for a little bit here too, because I might need to do that. So I did have what I need, but I think I also need the fatty meat, which I don't have too much of right now. I think I need 10 of them, if I'm correct. I feel like getting that would be nice right now, <laughs> up to this point. But finding wildlife, on on the other hand, is easier said than done. They like to um, show up when they want. Done. No one else will die because of them. Back the other way, I guess. Rich meat, not fatty meat, though. <laughs> mm. 
maybe you got it, what I need, Mr. Turkey. Fresh right. as it comes. That's some fatty meat. We need more freaking animals. Where are you at? these ones? No. Unfortunately not. <laughs> Darn. I can't kill some random dude's boars. <laughs> Only I was allowed to. Oh, oh shit. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> well... Uh, how much do I have now of that? Six. I and I need a few. I need ten. These guys drop a lot of it. This old last. Yep. Animals over here. Rich meat, not fatty meat, unfortunately. Wildlife. Okay. There's a boar over there. I'll go after him. These guys, just just in case. Save this for later. All right, what's that put me now? Eleven. Okay, so I think I have enough now. So now, let us head over here. I will pick up the uh, the better fast travel, so I don't have to constantly make them anymore. So weird they make you have to uh, make it. So that you, it doesn't work like once you, once you've gotten to a place, that's all you need. <laughs> okay, so what was it under? Yeah, here we go. The Golden Fast Travel Pack. All right, I believe this is what it was. So now I can fast travel anywhere in the world now, I believe. Good. 
So no longer do I have to worry about any of that. Alright. Nice. So now I can just fast travel wherever now, right? Let's see here. Yeah. Cool. Awesome. <laughs> so now I don't have to worry about any, any fast traveling anymore. <laughs> or uh, having to make stuff to fast travel anymore. Thank God. <laughs> I can just fast travel with ease now. Okay. there was a <laughs> mount close by. Actually, there is. It's right here. An old remedy. All right, let me grab this uh, mount. Right in the butt, yeah. The weak spot for anything to for anything to get override. Alright. To curse the darkness. Alright. There are the handholds. I it said they'd be. Did you get that silence? No? Fitting name we got there. My mouth's in the way. Alright. <laughs> Up we go. Alright. Take a seat at the campfire and we'll have a little chat. Nice of you to finally drop by. Our purpose this night is to crash the focus network. Yeah, tell me the part I don't know. How? For starters, you'll need to infiltrate the Eclipse's main base. Wait, what? That's right. Fortunately for you, I brought you around to the back way. It's right through that crevice. Once you reach the base, you'll see the objective. A derelict tall neck that's been extensively modified. Climb the tall neck. Grafted into the top of its disc, you'll find a 
module of sorts. Destroy that, and the focus network will crash. So you were part of the Eclipse? I've never been part of anything. I serve my own interests always. But it is the case that I assisted the Eclipse before I sensed the threat they might become. It was a mistake that I'm doing what I can to correct. What sort of assistance did you give them? Head through that crevice, Aloy. You have more important things to do than ask questions. Fine. <laughs> Guy's pretty <laughs> sus. <laughs> That's even with those. That's crazy. this oh what are you weak to all oh, electricity Well, I see, I gotta go that way. Explosions in the distance. Pay that no mind. 
doesn't concern me. Everything concerns me, because I'm the main character. <laughs> uh inventory, let's let's see, what can we get rid of here? Uh This, I guess. Oh, I didn't actually need that. Get that. Or do that. Um. There, I see. Oh God! Well, I thought I, I thought I could be sneaky there. Okay. <laughs> well, that was sneaky enough. You getting this? I see the legs of a tall neck down there, but no tall neck. Damn. The transmitter has been moved. Check down the ravine to the left. The only place it could be. So much for your insider knowledge. Toward the explosions. Great. You got exactly one shot at this Aloy, so spare the sarcasm and make it count. You see that bridge over the ravine? Yep. Memorize its location. There's a rappel point on the side. That'll be your way out. And these Eclipse troopers? Avoid them or kill them, your choice. The blasting should cover any noise you make. Find the tall neck and destroy the module on top. Here we go. Well, this should be fun. Stay alert. His post to eat his fill. Needless to say, we taught him the error of his way. Look out! It's her! Was there a guy behind me? Oh, there was. I was like, how, how was I taking? I was like, how was I taking damage? So that explains. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, darn. My my melee weapon sucks. It's all about the bow and arrow, baby. That's all. That's what matters in this game. It is an honor to guard that which helps us see. And then I get the slow animation. Intruder! 
<laughs> Insert goofy yell there. Is there fighting up ahead? It's a mining operation. So long as you're quick, it won't affect you. Oh good, another secret. That's all about secrets. Ooh, I definitely needed those. Okay. Get me out of here, but first I need to crash the network. The network? Alright. Uh, let's look what's on that side. Uh, or maybe it's in there? Ah, here we go. What is this place? A distraction. There are several data points. Ooh. Some armor. So long as King Itaman languishes at sunfall. Come. Oh, whoops. Didn't mean to skip that. I was just trying to <laughs> loot that. Guy's a jerk face. <laughs> All right, I am up here. I see the module. Good. Now be quick. This, this is Hades. Hello, and this is not the time. It's a metal devil. Open the module's casing now. Aloy, do as I say, or all is lost. Well, entity has come here. Oh, God, entity miscalculated. Entity cannot destroy me. I am beyond its reach. Maybe you are. But this isn't! Destroy the entity! Oh god. Not this again. <laughs> or that guy again. Run! 
Oh god. Ow. Yeah, you think? What do you think I'm doing? Taking a nap? I'm out of here. Whoa, Come Jesus. Head left towards the camp. Got it. Almost there. The whole base is on high alert. Yeah, I noticed. Yeah. Keep running. Work up the cluster ravine. Bridge in sight. That's the way out. No. I'm gone. <laughs> Out of here. Oh God. going but you survived you knew Hades was there and you sent me to him I won't deny I risked your life but it was the only way now with the focus network down we can both get what we want access to the secrets of zero dawn I'm past trusting you with secrets good that means you're wising up trust is for fools it shifts and crumbles like sand. A poor foundation for any partnership. But mutual self-interest. Now that is a solid bedrock upon which you and I might build a new science of understanding. We both need answers, Aloy. And thanks to you, we're on the verge of grasping them. It's unfold. We'll speak again. You miserable... Damn him. All right, mission complete. If I could toss this focus and be rid of you, Silence, I would. But we both know I need it. Sunfall it is. And Zero Dawn. Close to level 32 there. Nice. Uh, I got a skill point. That's about it. Not much else. All right, so I got to go all the way to Sunfall, which is all the way back over there now. All right. Which is the fastest way I could get there? Uh, looks like this campfire right here. But thank God I can just fast travel as much as I want now because now I don't have to worry about that because I have the, the mega fast travel, which means I can just fast travel as much as I want without having to re uh, craft new, 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 uh, new fast travel packs. Thank goodness on that. No space. Uh, which one was that in there? That was a regular one. I will use one. Fatty meat, 60. Uh, what else? What can I... What could I use to just get rid of here? Maybe this one. All right. 
quick save or quick save right there. Now I need to get over there. Is that a, uh... Oh, no. I don't think it is. Oh, no, it is. I could totally get a mount over here. Let's work together. See you later. Holy shit, there's so many. <laughs> there is so many freaking <laughs> mechs over here. Cool, I got a wildlife kill. From this Aloy. That's what I'm hoping. I suppose. Okay. A new little town over here. <laughs> Guess we have not been here before. Ooh. There's actually a, uh, a little cave over here. I didn't think that woman was old enough to catch her death from chill. Can't carry more. Let's see what they got the shop here. If anything good. Stuff that I already own, unfortunately, that I can get for purple. Because I don't have sp specific stuff. Did I crash the success? Welcome to the Citadel, Aloy. I'll check back with you in a moment. In the meantime, circulate. Outlanders, if you want to hear about today's bounties, head for the throne room. You're not going to make any shards by standing out here. I'll okay. Take the shards, even if it means having a listen of a hobbits. I hear the Shadow Cards are looking for one of their own. Should pay well. Remember your place, stranger. All right, I'm in the citadel. <laughs> we are sun suddenly playing Mass Effect. By the glory of the sun revealed. Behold, Radiant Edaman, the one true Sun King. The light in shadow, whose will is light and whose light is law. I command Lucian Bahavas to speak in my behalf. By the will of Radiant Edaman does the sun glare down mercilessly upon the traitor Uthid. To the hunter who brings his head to us shall go a bounty of 500 shards. More prisoners than royalty, don't you think? Mm. Love your hair. Not only did the wretch conspire to 
You and I need to chat, little huntress. The green tent down in Shadowside? I'll be waiting. Kind of busy. We both know you're no killer for hire. Uthid is innocent. So come see me while there's still time to save him. So, the way in I spoke of is right behind you. You've got to be kidding. Not hmm? at all. And you needn't worry about the Kestrels. They'll be too busy acting important to pay attention to you. First time in the Citadel, gotta see the sun ring from on high. Look All right, uh, go to the Grand ah, Balcony. They want us to see this, boy. Let's try it around it like makes you own quite an impression. This is insane. Hardly. They're going to see me. You underestimate the ease of hiding in plain sight. The balustrade. It's a short drop from there. Oh, do I actually have to jump off? If you're gonna watch some slaughter, this is the place to do it. I don't like heights. You worry me, boy. You worry me. Uh, well, I gotta get down there. Ah, right here. Well, not what I was intending. The other side of the tower. Look for a vent. <laughs> Not what I was intending, but I guess that works. I see you've been here before. Obviously. Now, it's very important that you hear what I'm about to say. <sighs> I've shown you the way in, but this humble vent marks a point of no return. Before you descend into the depths here, you should be fully committed, equipped, and focused. No distractions. If you have errands to run, do them first or hold your peace. I won't tolerate whining. Is that clear? You'll tolerate what I give you, Silence. I didn't ask you along for the ride. All right, go in. <laughs> That's one way down, yeah. <laughs> I'm heading down. Whatever works. I've spent a lifetime trying to uncover the secrets of this world. Where the machines came from. How the old ones achieved such marvels only to fall into silence and death. A lifetime of failure, as year by year, decade after decade, I hit walls I could not break, doors I could never breach. Hello. Until a Nora Huntress marched out of the savage east. And, voila, for her, all the deepest secrets of the earth were laid bare. I suspect you will have an easier time with this door than I did years ago. Hold for identiscan. Genetic profile confirmed. Entry authorized. Malfunction. 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 Are you kidding me? Yeah. Be, be laughing. Shut up. There's gotta be another way. Hey! Elizabeth Sobek here! Requesting access! Access request acknowledged. Root command functions available. Do you wish to proceed? I do! Get me through this door! Analyzing. Primary access inoperable due to mechanical failure. Emergency venting procedure likely to circumvent blockage. Well... Do you wish to proceed? Yes. Emergency venting authorized. Emergency venting? It's kind of sus. <laughs> oh god! Draw attention. We won't have this place to ourselves for long now. We? Last I checked, I was the one whisking my life down here. Yes, fine. Now, will you please get moving? There's so much to learn in less time than I'd hoped. <laughs> uh oh, sussy. Yep. <laughs> All right. Let's explore Project Zero Dawn Project facility. Zero Dawn. Zero Dawn. We found it. Are you really so surprised? <laughs> Facility diagnostics detect multiple failures. Attempting repair. So, what was this room? An entrance hall, perhaps. 
Have a look around. Lots of collectibles in here. Like snacks. Uh, nothing on that side. Okay, I guess keep going forward. Holographic theater. CD01 data intact. Initiating playback. Welcome to Project Zero Dawn. I am General Harris, Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff of the United States of America. I'm sure you've heard the rumors that Zero Dawn is a top secret super weapons program, the technological miracle that will save us from the Pharaoh Plague. If Operation Enduring Victory can hold off the robots long enough. The reason I'm sure you've heard the rumors is that I'm the one who spread them. And they are all lies. Zero Dawn is not a super weapons program. And it will not save us. Nothing will save us. And here's why. By the time the glitch was noticed, it was already too late. Nothing could stop the Pharaoh Plague. Nothing can. Its robots will continue to replicate and devour the biosphere. Life on Earth will be destroyed. Our planet reduced to a barren sphere. Global extinction is inevitable. No matter how many we kill, the robots just keep exponentially making more. If we had their deactivation codes, we could shut them all down. The entire swarm. But since their cryptographic protocols use polyphasic entangled waveforms, cracking a code set would take half a century. At best, we've got 16 months. Not exactly what you'd call a survival option. The destruction of a biosphere is not the sort of apocalypse you can wait out in a fallout shelter or a space station. There will be no Earth left to reclaim. Just a lifeless, toxic rock with several million pharaoh robots on it, hibernating waiting for something to eat. This is the horrible truth behind the lies of Operation Enduring Victory. My lies. Lies designed to inspire millions of innocents to sacrifice themselves in battle. Why? One reason. To buy time for you and the work you will do here. Zero day. The day that life on Earth ceases to exist is coming fast. It cannot be stopped. The hope of Zero Dawn is that something new might come after. But I will leave it to Elizabeth Sobek to shine that thin ray of light into the darkness. Harris, out. So everyone fucking died. <laughs> Not just humans, animals. But not in humans and animals, but also plants. Life on Earth didn't cease to exist. He said it could not be stopped. But it was. Somehow, somehow Elizabeth saved us. I've, I've got to keep looking. Find out how she did it. But yes, yeah, some some people survive. We'll have to find out what, who, how that exactly happened. Uh. Castrols. They got in. Through the vents. Let nothing stop you from learning the truth. Spread out! If it moves, kill it! What is this place? Tomb? Oh boy. Time to do some stealthy. Uh. I guess I 
can't go up there like that? I guess not. Okay. Uh, drop down. Look alive. Don't let her get past you while you gape like fools. Okay, they're all on the other side. Let me uh, loot everything here. Okay. I uh, can't go in that room, unfortunately. Uh... <laughs> That's everything, okay. We good, we good, we got everything. What if it doesn't move? Good question. CDO2 data intact. Initiating playback. Elizabeth Sobeck. You've heard the bad news, and it's all true. The Pharaoh Plague is devouring the biosphere. Life itself will cease to exist. But does that have to be the end? What if we could give life? A future. What if we could build a kind of seed from which, on a dead planet, life could blossom anew? This is the aim, the hope, of Project Zero Dawn. To create a super intelligent, fully automated terraforming system and bring life back from lifelessness. What would such a system require? At its core, it would need a true AI, fully capable of making the trillions of decisions necessary to reconstitute the biosphere. An immortal guardian, devoted to the reflourishing of life. We call it Gaia. Mother Nature as an AI. But that's just the core of the system. She will need to be surrounded and empowered by a comprehensive suite of subordinate functions. Think of them as extensions of Gaia's mind, each dedicated to a specific purpose. Now these aren't AIs, but make no mistake, each presents an engineering challenge more profound than anything the human species has ever before attempted. Hardware that preserves and then gestates the billions of seeds and embryos from which life will be reborn. The construction of underground facilities to hold it all. And that's just the start. We don't have to build the entire system. The beauty of a fully automated terraforming system is that it can build itself. Now over the days to come, you'll learn how all these functions, all these pieces that you'll be working on, fit together. How we'll race the clock to execute our harvest initiatives, write the software, build the tech and the facilities. How we'll lock it down and seal it up before the inevitable occurs. But even more important, you'll know how it doesn't end here. How Gaia will generate those deactivation codes General Harris talked about, and build the transmission arrays to broadcast them, shutting down the feral robots for good. How Gaia will not just build, but imagine any conceivable robot it needs to do its work across centuries. From detoxifying the Earth's ravaged atmosphere and poisoned seas, to the regreening of the Earth from cryopreserved seed stalks, to rewilding the Earth with animal life. And then, when all that is done, 
how a new generation of human beings spawned at cradle facilities around the globe will partake of Apollo. The vast archive of human knowledge and cultural achievement from which they will learn of us, our world, and most important, how not to repeat our mistakes. It's not an impossible dream. It is within our grasp if we work tirelessly and stop at nothing to achieve it. We can't stop life from ending. But if you will help me, help Gaia, we can give it a future. Join me and help make that future real. Okay, so that, that makes a little bit more sense. The whole earth destroyed, but then remade? Yes, by a machine. A machine of creation. Elizabeth did this for life, for us. But why Hades then? If it was part of Gaia, how did it end up in the wreckage of a pharaoh robot? And why does it want to kill me? And Apollo, the archive of knowledge, what happened to that? I'm as confused as you are. Maybe the answers lie ahead. Alright. Maybe there are answers coming up here. Got all this stuff. Intruder! Get her! Oh. Get her! Oh. Here. She's coming! Don't die now. Alright, time to wreck these guys. Grant me victory. Whoa. Nice. <laughs> Got him. Level 32, baby! Alright. Which means... After this mission, we'll get another skill point, probably. How is there? Is there another route? He is I've done this before. In a way. Just need my focus. Expression on the grandest scale. But there is so much unfairness. Why was I chosen? Was it decided by committee? By algorithm? My family will be saved because I happen to graduate in art history? Is this right? Dr. Souvet? Christina Souvet? Yes. I met a man, another historian. His fields are Bauhaus and the new materialists. But he once attended one of my tours. Another unfair chance. Of all the many people in that auditorium, that we should both be here now. And yet, I feel more accepting of my fate. No, it is not fair. Not at all. But for the sake of my family. For the sake of art. Art is alive. One second here. Before you continue. Uh, let me just uh, drop some stuff. Uh, let's see. Uh, what do I drop even in this case? I don't know. Maybe this one. And then... This one. Well, I guess she won't be continuing that. Uh, what is down here? Here we go. Another one of these. Need to find the right configuration. Alright, another code. 
Hey, I'm done with Brett's incompetence, okay? Somehow, he managed to install an H emitter node backwards. Everything's in reverse. I don't get paid to clean up Brett's messes. If you want it fixed, send him up to storage for a new emitter, not me. Parker out. Up, left, down, right, up. There's a part missing. Maybe there's a storage area nearby. Uh, left, up, left, down, right. Done. I should check the door nearby. Uh, which door open? Is it over here? Ah, yes. Bunch of loot, that is. over here. Store power. Door is locked over there, so I don't know. Be back over there. has to do something good in this room here. Right here. 
I thought that was supposed to look for something else. Okay. Now let's get that door open. No, no. I'm good. Okay. That. Then down. Uh. That way. And up. Let's see. Alright, up. Yeah, down. Oh, is it upside down? Oh, I think it might be, actually. I think it's supposed to go... Down. Um... Right. Up. Unless we go the other way, maybe? So... Let's see. Maybe we go... Uh, go down. Should have power. No, there we go. Be okay. So now we can go in here. Oh. We got friends in here. Eclipse. They're here. Avoid contact. Lines look good. Gaia. It's up there. Second floor. Can you reach it? So much for avoiding contact. How are you doing? Let's get rid of this guy. Oh, I have no ammo. Oh crap! I've never, I haven't run out of that ammo in a while. There we In, in Horizon. Yeah, it's hit or miss for me too. Aw, oh, dang, I thought I got that. Oh, not. 
Oh, more? Well, that's... Oh, that's great. Four. Ah, better. Okay. Anyway. Get moving. You have to find Gaia. <sighs> yeah, I know. I kind of just go <laughs> uh, arrows a blazing or guns a blazing <laughs> for the most part. Hello, I'm Margot Shen, and this is Hephaestus. As the name might tip you off, this is going to be the subordinate function that Gaia will use to make lots and lots of robots. Her personal forge. Except, it's not that simple. Um, so like, you probably noticed that only about a third of you are robotics engineers. The rest, experts in machine cognition, virtual heuristics, that stuff. Well, that's because we aren't going to be the ones designing and building robots. The last thing we want is to burden Gaia with a bunch of outmoded 21st century designs. A waste of time. Our purpose is to empower Gaia to build the robots. And not just build, imagine, from scratch. Any robot she needs for any conceivable purpose, designed and fabricated at a snap of a finger. Hers. Her finger. So, Hephaestus isn't really the forge. It's more like the knowledge of craft and ingenuity of a master smith to wield the hammer. Encoded as software. Virtual creativity made real. Gaia's already learning. In simulation, she's doing some very creative things with fractal assembly and animal morphologies. Her designs aren't about to win the Liam Prize anytime soon, but hey, everyone has to start somewhere. So, yes, time to get started. Let's do this. I don't get it. Which part? It's a little technical in places. If Gaia was designed to save life, why would the robots it makes attack people? Perhaps it loves some forms of life more than others. The derangement. The machines weren't always so angry. True. Mostly they were docile until 10, 15 years ago. For years, Hephaestus has been forcing cauldrons to make aggressive machines. I've seen it myself, in the cauldrons. Stalkers, ravagers, the Thunderjaw. How could it do that? And why? Why indeed. <laughs> I really do love learning the lore of the game from the game. Many games made it. Yeah, yeah, indeed. It's a very uh, interesting plot and setting, that's for sure. <laughs> I kind of like it. Hello. I'm Margot Shen, and this is Hephaestus. Oh, is this the same thing? As the name might tip you off, this is going to be the subordinate function that Gaia will use to make lots and lots of robots. Her personal forge. Except, it's not that simple. Um, so like, yeah, you probably thing. noticed okay. that only... I'm not gonna listen to you again. <laughs> the rest, experts in the right. Uh, oh, there's loot over there. We aren't going to be the ones designing and building can't go wrong with all the loot even though I have to get rid of it and such which is my my big complaint of this game is the looting system it's it's uh, inventory system it's not the best that's probably the most, my least favorite thing so far is the inventory system it's like you have to like you'll get all the stuff and it's like you have to drop something just to be able to hold something yeah it's not the best Uh, oh, I can't do it from there. I think this is it. Elizabeth Sobeck's office. But it, it's sealed off. There's got to be a way inside. More Eclipse. Careful now. Alright, more somewhat trying to stealth somewhat. Not really. <laughs> I 
coming up there. Ah. Uh. species and the wellspring of knowledge for future generations. I am Samina Elbaji. Until recently, I was director of the International Collective Memory Institute in New Tehran. As a heritage professional, I devoted my career to the preservation of human knowledge, creative endeavor, and cultural achievement. Apollo is, therefore, the ultimate embodiment of a lifelong passion albeit under the very worst circumstances imaginable. The challenges before us are immense. Specifically, we will have to design and implement four major initiatives simultaneously. First, the construction of data repositories in cradle facilities around the world ensuring redundancy. Second, the collection and processing of a projected 180 million discrete data entries. 42 zettabytes of data in Mandarin, English, Spanish, and Arabic. Third, the transferal and encoding of all that data onto DNA encapsulated in synthetic fossils. The only medium capacious and durable enough to safeguard it without degradation for the centuries to come. And last, but not least, the development of the holographic interface and gamified curricula by which future humans will commune with Apollo, progressively unlocking heuristic learning modules, leveling up their knowledge and skills they will need to take control of the terraforming system. Life is an RP, uh, is an MMO <laughs> in the future. <laughs> not just the preservation of the past, but the seed for the flourishing of a new tree of knowledge. Welcome, and let us begin. Life will become Final Fantasy XIV in the future. <laughs> I know some people of mine uh, that I know will be pretty happy about that. Uh, that in there, okay. Alright, well, I got a bunch of dudes in here. Time to take them all out one by one. Handy. With my bone arrow, because it's the most overpowered thing in this game. <laughs> Headshots galore. It's fear. Show yourself. It's only fair. Oh, what the fuck? That was a close one. <laughs> Dude with gun up there. Got a guy right there. I, I, I. Somewhere. She can't hide forever. All right. Here we go. And now we just have guy with gun. That might have been the best stealth section in the entire game so far, <laughs> and that says a lot. Um, just gotta figure out how to get to him now. Is he up higher or is he lower? I can't tell. He might be up there. Oh, yeah, he is. Okay. Okay. 
Uh, Aloy, can you get up here? No? Thank you. <laughs> this is the last of them. Alone once more. In what should have been a cave of wonders. Look around. See if anything is left. All right. The longbow? Yeah. Welcome oh. to Hades. Zero Dawn's extinction failsafe protocol. The ultimate killer app. Now, I know what you're thinking. The purpose of Gaia is to resurrect life. So why give her a subordinate function, only purpose of which is to wipe out life all over again? I mean, what the... What? Just what the nanny? Crazy, ain't it? Well, no, it isn't. Reconstituting a biosphere? That's a tall order. Tech smart as Gaia may be, odds are she won't get it right the first time. I mean, imagine your Gaia 200 years from now and this new biosphere growing, it's all gone wrong. Alkalines are skyrocketing, coniferous forests eroding under the lash of superstorms that would have drowned Noah. It's chaos. Spinning top that won't stop wobbling. Now what are you gonna do? Release phase one organisms into that hot mess? Hope their CO2 and methane can balance out what you got started? Hell no. What you're gonna do, Gaia, is step aside while Hades takes over and does what you're just too darn nurturing and life-loving to do. Which is burn that misbegotten mess of a biosphere to the ground so Gaia can start over. Okay. Not burn, more like reverse terraforming operations and suffocating. But you get the idea. Hades takes the biosphere back to zero. Square one, blank slate. And then, only then, does it hand the steering wheel back to Gaia and say, try again, old girl. And better this time, or we'll have to do this again. That's Hades. It's pretty badass when you think about it. Extinction on demand. Death on speed dial. All for the greater good, of course, but still, kind of metal. So welcome to Hades. Welcome to the Void. Okay, so if that's the original purpose of Hades, why does it want me extinct? We need more data. And how does it end up in the wreckage of a pharaoh titan? Getting worshipped by the Eclipse like some kind of god. I'm learning as you are, Aloy. Keep searching. Alright. Uh, more of those. Looks like the only way onwards. Area is huge. Welcome to Eleuthia, the crown and king of Gaia's subordinate functions. For it is by Eleuthia that the human race will continue to exist. I am Patrick Brochard Klein, the Alpha in charge of this program. Now let one thing be perfectly clear from the outset Eleuthia is not a genetic engineering project. Our goal is to preserve the human genome, not alter it. A snapshot of human genetic diversity, literally frozen in time. The genetic quintessence of our species, unmodified. Under my watch, our activities and initiatives will comply with the 2034 clone provisions and the 2048 rally accords. Now that may seem a quaint, even trivial concern to you in light of present circumstances. But, as one of the authors of the Accords, it is far from trivial to me. The practical challenges before us are staggering in scope and complexity, but not insurmountable. No. Global collation and provisional storage of zygotes, perfection of exogenic technologies, design and perfection of servitors, 
to provide nurture and inculcation during early child development, all of these program components must and will proceed in tandem. To say nothing of the breakneck construction of cradle facilities at sites around the world. So, si vous êtes prêt, let us begin. So what he says that most capitalities were destroyed and rebuilt over and over many times even before the calamity. Super advanced wars hit like natural disaster strategic targets are all AI generated. That's crazy. <laughs> oh, uh, oh, oh, that's the hollow. Okay. I thought that was scanning for something else right there. Noise. Some good loot. Are these what I what I think they are? Artificial wombs. Machines to spawn a new generation of human beings. Kinda reminds me of the uh, little pods that uh like like the pod from like uh, Halo 3, or at least Halo in general where they where they store Master Chief in the, in it. And then he he like sleeps in there until he's awoken. <laughs> so, he's so he's frozen until he need he's needed. Or even like uh, Captain America even. Elizabeth said a, a new or, fa or like Fallout. Of humans would be spawned inside such places. She did. Oh, Mother Mountain. It was one of them. There's only one way to be sure. The hatch wouldn't open. Something, something about a corrupted alpha registry. I need to search Elizabeth's office. All right, climb it up. Uh, is there anything behind here? Uh, no, no, there isn't. Okay. You're a quick study, Gaia. Dr. Sobek, as I have conducted this comparative analysis of mammalian morphologies, I've gathered extensive data on the Quaternary Extinction event. Oh? And your assessment? Gaia? Logically speaking, the extinction was a natural consequence. And yet... And yet... I find the loss of megafaunal species uncountably sad that they passed forever into oblivion causes me to experience a grief that is difficult to describe. Am I malfunctioning? No, no, Gaia, you're not. This is good. It's very good. Maybe people were born from fossilized cloning machines and if most Texas fossils now, how come our small things like fa because it's are functional? Yeah, that's a good question, yeah. That is a good question. You will undergo a brief period of unconsciousness during relocation to Prime and final statement. Elizabeth, may I speak outside protocol? When you're back up and running at the new site, we'll bring the subordinate functions online and see where we stand. Elizabeth. I detect distress. Are you all right? I'm fine. I realize that circumstances compel us to launch earlier than we hoped, but all subsystems are operational. The odds stand in our favor. But what if... Guy, there's nothing left out there. You can't even survive unless you're wearing an environmental suit. There are billions dead in fear and agony. What if... What if it was all for nothing? Elizabeth, extinction was inevitable. Thanks to you, life will have a future. You really believe that? I believe in you, Elizabeth. In you, all things... 
Well. What unfortunate timing for it to not to, to, to corrupt. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, there's something in there. Uh, is there a door around there? Yes. Bunch of things in here. The Alpha Registry Master File. Intact? Yeah. No signs of corruption. Then what are you waiting for? Copy the file. With this, I can restore the registry at the hatch inside All Mother. Open it. Go inside. And grasp the secrets within. Where I was born. Maybe. Maybe who gave birth to me. Who? Are you really so naive? There will be no who waiting for you there, Aloy. Whatever birthed you into the world was a what, not a who. You bastard. Oh, no, I had a legitimate birth. It's you, Aloy, who are the creation of a machine. But what kind of machine and why? Why were you created? Eclipse. You need to get out of there. What you found is too valuable. You're too valuable. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Gave me the gears of war. <laughs> Darn. Well, that's one way to go out, I guess. My entire life, I've always known one thing with prophetic certainty. That I was destined for glory as a great champion of the sun. Even when Joran was murdered. Even when Meridian fell. I never doubted my destiny. Until you came along. When I heard that you had survived, a doubt took root in my mind. As sure as the sun rises and falls each day, those I am bade to kill die. And yet I failed. How? Why? With each dig site you attacked, each loyal soldier you killed, this pestering doubt grew. I kept thinking of the moment my knife pierced your throat. One twist, a simple tug of the blade, and you would have bled out. In slaughter, I am a practiced hand. So why hesitate? Why fail my destined purpose? See that scar on your cheek? You didn't get to finish. <laughs> yes, I remember. He fought well. For a savage. His name was Rost. And he was a better man than you could ever hope to be. The better man is the one who doesn't end up with his guts steaming on the ground. <laughs> no. It wasn't him. I could have finished you before he attacked. But I didn't. This failing troubled my thoughts, haunted every step. It was only when I captured you, down in that place, that I finally glimpsed the sun's design etched at length across the course of events. You were meant to survive that day on the mountain, meant to interfere at dig sites and kill my men. Conversely, 
I was meant to capture you. Here. So that you might die as a sacrificial offering to the sun. Everything as it was meant to be. Predestined and preordained. You're an idiot. A dangerous idiot. But an idiot. All this talk of destiny and fate. I'm sure Hades speaks the same language, doesn't he? You're being played for a fool. Hades is an ancient machine, not the buried shadow of Karja myth. It doesn't care about Meridian. It wants to kill everything and everyone. And you are its dutiful slave. I serve not the buried shadow, but the sun in shadow. Of nature joined to one cause shadow to sun, dark to light. Do you really not hear how ridiculous that sounds? You've gone from serving an insane homicidal sun king to an insane homicidal machine. You're moving down in the world, not up. I'll remember those words as I watch your corpse burn, whatever's left of it. You fail to grasp the point. As surely as you've been conquered, so has all doubt. And with certainty of belief comes unstoppable force. Then come to cage and put your faith to the test. See if things work out like you expect. The circle has closed. Every element is in its proper place, exactly where it belongs. The errant beast, now caged, will serve her true purpose. A sacrificial animal. Oh, speaking of sacrifice, I forgot to tell you. After you crashed the Eclipse Network, I sent messengers into the East to rally the forces there and mount an invasion of the sacred land. Uh-oh. I ordered every Nora killed. I was hoping to catch you there, but alas, it all seems to have been unnecessary. Why butcher dozens of innocents for no gain? It's a waste of effort. You're right. I won't even be there to enjoy it. In any case, I couldn't recall the order even if I wished to. Thanks to your destruction of the network, communication over distances is impossible. You not only doomed yourself, but an entire tribe. Do we not see the scorching judgment of the sun in these events? Your focus, such a powerful device, isn't it? And yet, so fragile. Damn. <sighs> so you see, this time, I did not hesitate. The knife has already been twisted. Yeah, sometimes the lip syncing doesn't look really good. <laughs> Hopefully that's that's addressed in the sequel. Sometimes it looks okay, and then other times it's not. <laughs> I'm noticing that too. It just depends on the character and model too. Rejoice! Our years in shadow are over. A new dawn trembles on the horizon. A new day soon to break. And when it does, the false Sun King will be dead. And Holy Meridian ours once more. In this, I have become an instrument of prophecy. All halves of nature join to one cause. Shadow to sun, light to dark, night to day. Behold! Oh, good. <laughs> Here come the Metal Gears. <laughs> kind of remind me of some. Hold your seats. 
Can you not see the proof of the sun's blessing before your eyes? How else could shadows such as these prowl in broad light of day? Were they not approved by the sun and joined to our cause? Many years ago, to consecrate this great ring, the Radiant Turan ordered many faithless, crushed beneath the hooves of the behemoth. Mighty is the behemoth in the eye of the sun, but it is mightier still in view of the power of shadow. Let this one, who schemed and slithered, be the first to die! Let her be the first of thousands! Such hairless bodies they have, I know, right? Where do they get their grooming? Oh god! <laughs> oh god! Without a weapon, too, that's gonna be fun. I'll never beat that thing without weapons. My weapons are up on the platform. There's no way out of this room. Maybe I could use the strength against it. Oh, do I gotta like? That pillar's weak. Yep. Another hit, and that pillar will come down. Okay, okay. Oh, I see what we gotta do. Ram him into these. Yeah, I thought so. Oh god. Okay, get over here. Not what I was hoping for right there. Try luring the behemoth into the pillars. There we go. There we go. One more. Unless it will come down. Oh, of course, it's stuck it's stick it's gets stuck right there. Or or not, never mind, it came down. Hey, had enough time to get back into my clothes. <laughs> Let's go. What? Are you not entertained? <laughs> hey, guess who got her weapons back? Whoa! Now you're just a big dumb target. Come and get it. There we go. We're gonna tie it down. Okay, uh, I have an idea. Oh, I'm dying. Oh, okay, that hurt. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why they kept that they make me keep my my herbs. I don't know. <laughs> you think they would take that? They would confiscate that. <laughs> Those components on the sides of its head. They've got something to do with swift attacks. Oh, oh dang. Oh, there he is. Oh, I just missed it again. Because plot force? Yeah, you're probably right. Nice. That canister on its belly. This looks important. Ow. Alright, so probably shoot like a uh, explosive at its belly right there. Just like that, yep. Nice, got it again. Probably kept it in my braids, yeah. 
It's a good hiding spot. They'll never know. Ooh, fuck. Okay, that hurt. Uh, let's see if I can stun him. Uh okay. Ooh, nice. Oh god, that hurt. Okay. I don't think that's how physics work. <laughs> I don't think they can just homing attack you like that. Oh, I just missed it. Oh, he actually has an attack where he locks in on you. Okay. It's an earthbender, got it, okay. I didn't realize it was actually doing that. That that that, that makes more sense then. Liking my chances right now. So that attack, that attack is disgustingly good. So close to dying too, but that tech sucks. <laughs> hey! Guess who got her weapons back? Now you're just a big dumb target. Come and get it! That rock snipe, I know! Oh god! <laughs> Flip Yoshi. <laughs> That rock was sent from Paper Mario? Oh yes. Good old Paper Mario. <laughs> uh, I'm good, just working on project things. Oh, that's cool, that's cool. Hopefully that's going well. Oh, just missed it. Oh, here we go. 
Oh damn, how did I miss that? I don't know, sometimes it feels like when I'm shooting things, like aiming at it, sometimes it just feels like it goes through it, through things sometimes. I don't know, that was clearly on target. That was clearly line of sight. That time I missed. That's that that that's that, that time was on me for sure. I think it turned around. What the hell? A <gasps> man just went yeet. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh good! <laughs> I just used all of my explosives. Kill her! Why leave it to them? Come get me yourself! Are you not entertained? <laughs> Again? Oh Jesus! Oh shit! He's actually a real person! <laughs> Silence. Nah, I guess I, yeah, I guess he always was. <laughs> oh damn, look at these things. That was a long mission, holy smokes. <laughs> Of course I did. If you'd been killed, Benora's sacred mountain would never have given up its secrets. 
Too bad you wasted your time, then. Helis destroyed my focus. And the Alpha Registry with it. Not at all. The whole time I've been monitoring your focus, I've duplicated every data file you scanned. Hey! Installing that data to a new focus was trivially easy. Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. You're really good at making it impossible to like you, Silence. <laughs> but I guess I need this. It's time to see where you were born. Maybe you'll even learn why. Yeah. Meet the machine that birthed me into this world. Isn't that how you put it? I'll be off. Wait. Yes? How did you track my location when I wasn't wearing a focus? Really, Aloy? <laughs> It doesn't take a genius to surmise that Helis would throw you into the sun wing at high noon. I wore out two striders getting here in time, but I did. Now be on your way. Since when can you override machines? Ever since you discovered the technique. I had to destroy a corrupter to obtain the necessary parts, of course. But your example showed me how to do that as well. Yet another benefit of monitoring your activities through your focus. Truth be told, the underlying logic of the technique isn't so different from rites practiced by Banuk shamans. Though, of course, far more advanced. Great. You're welcome, I guess. <laughs> Basically, he watched the playthrough, and that's how he learned how to hack. <laughs> that's what I'm getting at. <laughs> Basically, you can too, as long as you watch... You can also know how to override machines in this game. <laughs> Helis recognized you back in the Sun Ring. You told me that you'd assisted the Eclipse. Not that you knew the man who killed my... Who almost killed me. So now you know. The man is a serious threat. So let's do all we can to make sure that he and Hades don't succeed. Right. I'll be on my way. To make matters worse, Helis ordered an Eclipse detachment to attack the Nora Sacred Land. The tribe's already weak. They won't stand a chance. You should come with me. Well, absolutely not. I have preparations to make No, fuck that. I don't want to die. What kind <laughs> of... Why do I bother asking? You're not going to tell me. When the time is right, I'll be in touch. I'll contact you later. In the meantime, should you need to return to Shadow Karja territory, I brought armor to conceal your identity. Ooh. You think of everything, don't you? One of us has to. True. Aloy, when you were recovering the Alpha Registry down in the Zero Dawn bunker, I was needlessly cruel. For your sake, I hope there is someone waiting there for you inside the mountain. Not a what, but a who. Yeah. <laughs> the online stalker who that prefers to stay online, yeah. <laughs> All right. Terror of the Sun, main quest complete. All right. I only need two more quests now to do so I can get that last thing uh, for that super armor. We might as well get that armor tonight, as well. Rich to level 33. Nice. Just gonna grab that out of that box here real quickly. Because he's got stuff. Alright, do I have five? I have five skill points. Hot damn! Alright, we got some points to spend here. Alright. Uh, we got dodge, okay, we got, uh, concentration, we got double shot, that would be pretty decent, actually. Combat override, disarm traps would be pretty good, machine repair, haven't really used that that much. Fighting back, heavily spear attacks deal increased damage when Ally's, uh, health is low, that's pretty decent, actually. Uh, yeah, that armor would have came in handy right there, yeah. It sucks, you can't get it until after you beat, like, mich uh, two missions after that one, too, which is too bad. It's the only time it says you can get it, which is unfortunate. Uh, I guess I'll get this for now, and then I don't know what I'll get after that. Actually, I'll have to think about that. Uh, 
Freeze and Shock. You know what? I'll put that on, honestly. Why not? I don't have anything for that, unfortunately. Okay. Okay. Chips alloy. Uh, uh, al chips alloy. <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh, what is what is the vantage? The, what what is this exactly? I'm trying to. Not 100 percent sure what these are. I haven't really picked these up. It's like Assassin's Creed. No, that would be the the uh, the other thing. But we already got all those. See if I can get up. Uh, yeah. Old world artifacts. Oh, okay. So just collectibles then. Yeah, because I was curious what the heck these were. Because they're starting to peer a little bit more. No, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Relax, mount. It's up there. All right, yeah, you stay right there. I will. Uh, <laughs> we'll grab that real quickly here. And it looks like it's up here or down there. Uh, oh, it might be all the way up there. Oh, okay. Can I get up here? Yeah, okay. Oh, we got friends. Okay. Yeah, you wait right there, Bethesda. I will not Skyrim my. I, 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 I will scry, Skyrim my way up there. That was convenient. <laughs> that was a way to take care of that. Aha. I'll need those, actually. Um. Day 12. As we watch the booster arc up into the night sky, riding a pillar of flame, you took my hand, squeezed it, and said, You have written the story of our family across the stars. It's a good shot, actually. Dang. <laughs> Scenery's really good. Alright, so I got that? Yes, I did. Okay, cool. Okay, uh, let's call for our mount. If he can get up here. Can he Bethesda his way up here? He did! Wow, look at that! <laughs> Alright. Okay, um, so we gotta go all the way back over here. So that explains why that was closed earlier. Alright, so that explains why Mother's Watch was closed. Okay, because we, we went back there earlier to, to go grab one of those, um... What were they, they called? Um... Uh, it was a side mission, I know that. It was the, uh, the power cell. And, uh, you had to, like, I had to, like, Bethesda my way across, all around that place just to get to the darn thing. But I could have waited now to do it. That's fair. Um, uh, your fast travel not allowed for this location right now. Okay, can I fast travel right there? Alright, well, if I can't go right there, I'll go right there, then. <laughs> I know! Who'd have thunk, yeah. <laughs> Who'd have thunk? Oh! Now we're safe. <laughs> okay, that was a close one. <laughs> we almost died. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Anyway, <laughs> I I I didn't get a spot right right there. That's no fuck that. <laughs> that was close. <laughs> that was way too close. I was cutting it close right there. <laughs> I'll be back. I, I'll make my way there, not having to fight everybody. Yeah. 
<laughs> the smell, trees on fire, MC who fast shot into the heart of battle. <laughs> <laughs> so basically what this game is telling me you can't fast shovel there or right there because th there's there's stuff going down over here but right here where stuff is also going down is totally fine too you can you can go there that's fine <laughs> that's 100 percent a-okay You should, you should, you should just for the XP. I mean, I'm making my way back. I'm gonna have to fight him anyway, right? See, there they are, right there. <laughs> See, I'm back anyway. Okay, now we uh, we'll take care of this here. Dang, somebody fucked up their campfire. Am I right? <laughs> it's kinda... Should be making jokes right now. <laughs> there's, there's, there's Metal Gears coming after me. Gave it a good old uh, silent kill or silent attack, but no. But getting good as my mount is really good. No, get out of the way, mount. So bright. Ah, oh, jeez. Whoa, hello. Oh, if I'm not dead, oh, of course. What else can I attack? Not much, really. Ooh, shit. Okay. Oh. Are you bored? Ah. Damn it. There we go. Actually, eh, I'll just drop this. Don't need all that wood right now. And then I will drop. And I will drop hmm. Then I will drop
Hey, you know what? I'm gonna get rid of this for now. I'm gonna get rid of this fox. I have not really had any use for it. Use for another one. I got what I needed with it anyway, so I don't need another one right now. Damn, everything is fucked up in here. Another one. Shit, okay. That was a close one. <laughs> Not really. It's an OP strategy. Of course it is. Thank God nobody heard that one. <laughs> I was expecting like the whole the whole uh, the whole squad to show up right there. of you all there. There was no way to get around that. <laughs> Without starting an altercation. Oh, fuck. God damn. Let's get rid of him. Alright. Oh, God. Alright. Just gonna run. And that's where they gave up. <laughs> the eclipse smashed through. Uh, which way are we going? This way. The little icon was like... Not telling me where to go at first. I think... Not sure. Yeah, you would think he would notice, but he did, thankfully. <laughs> Thank goodness he did not. Yeah, nothing, in, nothing in particular really I need there. Point of stealthing in this game. If you can't stealth, oh. I'm gonna just eh. roll on in. Don't mind me. 
just gonna roll my way up. <laughs> Don't mind me. Doopy doo doo. The survivors must be holed up in the mountain. If the tunnel collapses, they'll be buried. I'll never reach the hatch. All right. <laughs> Braves, to Aloy's side now. For speed running through. Yep, <laughs> that's how we do it. Saves ammo. Varl and Sona. They're still alive. Alright, you guys take all care of everything for a minute. I, I gotta I gotta loot all the boxes. Ow. Holy fuck, hello. You gotta take another one of these guys? Oh my god. <laughs> Damn, alright, we gotta take out another T-Rex in this game. Alright, we took out, out one of them earlier. We get to do it again. Because I'm calling it a T-Rex. I don't I know it's probably not, but I'm calling it. Yeah, Thunderjaw, yeah. What? Oh, it eases us. Gun somewhere? Oh hell yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's go. <gasps> finish them. Yeah, you finish them. I'm uh I'm a loot. <laughs> I gotta loot this thing. Hold on. <laughs> uh disassemble that. Symbol. Symbol. Oh, not that one. Symbol. Green ones can go away, really. I, I'm good without those. <laughs> At this point. Let's see. Alright, oh, I'm stuck on something. Who's, who's fighting who? Oh, this guy. I see him. We win. We did it. Aloy did it. We Hell yeah, I did. Uh, 
All right. Hold up, I gotta loot all the things. Your deeds reenact the old stories. You saved the tribe. Did what no brave or war chief could do. I'm glad to see you're all right, Varl. You are all right. Since the proving, so much death. Is the killing over? For now, but this was just one battle, Varl. There are more to come. I see. So long as we have you to fight with us, I suppose we'll make do. How many survived the attack? Nearly all the matriarchs and many families, God be praised. But braves, just a few, and most of them are wounded. Never before has an enemy stabbed the heart of our people like this. Even the Karja, in all their red raids, never broke through to the embrace. Well, this enemy may have broken through, but they never got back out. We made sure of that. Tell me about the attack. What happened? They struck from the east. Our sentinels saw the killers coming. Said that beside them marched deathbringers and corruptors and other machines, driven mad. We took ground, met them with clouds of arrows. Some fell, but they kept coming. Finally, we withdrew to the gates of the embrace to make our stand. But they were too much for us. Those who survived fell back to the mountain. So the survivors took shelter in the mountain? By law, only matriarchs are allowed inside. It was Tirsa who broke the taboo, ordered the tribe into the mountain for safety. Lanzra, well, she didn't agree. But I don't think anyone heard her over all the screams and shouting. Tirsa's decision saved lives. Good for her. Common sense isn't always so common around here. Are your injuries serious? Bruises pale. Bones heal. Don't give me a hunting song, Varl. Are you okay? My body aches, but it's nothing that will keep me from fighting. I need to go inside the mountain. The matriarchs will be eager to see you. I'm sure, mm. but I didn't come here for them. Then, what for? You will see. First, I gotta loot things that I missed out on. That I could use. Like that. Uh, I don't need that. That. Oh, I didn't get this behind here. There we go. Uh. I will restock on that. And. We're good. Okay. We are good. <laughs> wow, look at that. I didn't have to glitch my way into this inside here now. <laughs> I could just walk straight in. What a concept. <laughs> Again, I probably should have just came back here later on if I knew that was going to happen. Uh, well, probably nothing to really look in here. I probably got everything from before, so... I don't think we need to worry about it too much. Okay. Anyways, in here we go. Oh, mother. Give me strength Aloy. to stand beside her. Oh, you've returned. Teb? Where's Teb? No, you're not Teb. Aloy, you've come back. The Seeker has returned. Come, speak to us. Foolish woman, you welcome a curse. Come, Seeker, we have much to discuss. Her very presence here is a blasphemy. You know what? Darn it. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna set you on fire, lady. There you go. You're you're lit. <laughs> so you have finally returned. Nice to see you again too, yeah. She only returned, but fought her way through many enemies to reach us. Outside, she brought low a corrupted thunderjaw. She lifted the siege. 
How was this done? By the will of All Mother. Have you returned to speak with the goddess, Aloy? Um... Yes, I guess you could say that. I think it'll work this time. Sisters, surely we cannot permit this. Because of her, our tribe teeters upon extinction. What if she has come to wake her father? Yo, shut the up! Devil. She means to finish our destruction. We must stop her. I fought my way past an army while you cowered in this cave. Yeah. You really think you can stop me? Aloy, that is not necessary. What would you know about what's necessary? About what it took for me to be standing here, now, on this threshold? This was my birthright. You don't get to take it from me a second time. Hold for identity scan. Error. Alpha registry corrupted. Correction. Alpha registry restored. Genetic identity confirmed. Entry authorized. Greetings, Dr. Sobek. You are clear to proceed. Oh boy, what's inside? I see you're inside. Figured I might be hearing from you. Shall we begin? I never stopped. All right. Time to search these ruins. Oh, what is this here right here? Purple. So this is Eleuthia. This is where I was born. Where you were made. So these are... Artificial wombs. The mothers of a new generation hundreds of years ago. And me. So this was it. Where you were born. But, but why? No, no, no. Player. These look like cribs. The cradles of a cradle facility. And those things, the, the multi servitors, they took care of them. There was no one else. Another day has passed. You mean the lights got dim? I don't want to sleep, Mother! I know, but it is time to get some rest. No, I'm king today. What I say goes. I want to see the real sun, not lights and pictures. You will, in time, children. In time, 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 in time. Ow. <laughs> Someday, that's what you always say. We want it now. 
It's big down there. Now, father. Children, that area is not yet available. Get him! Physical aggression detected. Physical aggression is not permitted. Except yours. Damn sentinels! Children, may I be of assistance? Go away, healer! Lena, you have suffered mild bruising. Go away! Blue is the color of the sky. White is the color of clouds. Yellow is the color of the sun. Green is the color of grass. Flowers can be any color. Take a look. These are yellow and black, and they love flowers. Here they come. <laughs> Where are they left? It's a mess. Everything's broken or painted on. How long did they live here? Children, let's run and jump and blow off steam. Leave us alone, Father. After what just happened, I can't leave you two alone. You broke community rules. Just let us talk, then. Go away. I'm sorry, children, but I must provide supervision. You're not even a person. You sound frustrated. Let's run and jump and go off steam. choice but to release you but why there is no food here anymore but there's food out there we don't know for sure come on let's go i don't know mother can we come back if we're cold i'm sorry but that won't be possible you will have to support yourselves now and take care of each other what will happen to you i will stay here and sleep and remember all of you what will happen to us you will be brave, and you will learn. They were trapped here. Their whole lives. In plain view of luxurious space. What, what went wrong? Why couldn't they access the other areas? Unknown. But you won't have that problem. Looks like they didn't like this door very much. It wouldn't open for them. Of course they hated it. What is in that door? Prepared for identity scan. Genetic identity confirmed. Entry authorized. Greetings, Dr. Sobek. You are cleared to proceed. Welcome to Lyceum, a place of learning. So... What was this place, exactly? The dream of Apollo. Never realized. Why not? Hello, child. My name is Samina. Today is a big day. Your first day of school. There's so much for you to learn. So much promise and possibility. Malfunction. Apollo offline. Apollo offline? You were right, Aloy. This is a graveyard. The charnel house of knowledge. What we might have achieved had we not been denied it. Maybe there's a way to fix it. But it's not why I came here. Of course. What's the whole of human knowledge next to the origin of one girl? Continue your search. I will. Oh, is this a schoolhouse? It seems like it's like a mix of like a schoolhouse, like a sanctuary, a hospital. It's like, it's like a bunch of different things in one. It's looking like. Hello, child. My name is Samina. Today is a oh. big day. Your first day of school. I already did that one. There's so much for you to learn. Hello, child. Ah. My name is Samina. <laughs> Today is a big day. Your first day of school. So much for you to learn. So much promise and possibility. Alert. Malfunction. Apollo offline. Alright, that looks like that's it. <laughs> From there to look around it? Alright. I guess we'll head into the room we gotta go into, which is right over here. Please scan 
Message with focus. Well, that sounds important. Yes. I suspect we're about to learn a great deal. Oh boy. We're gonna find out some answers. Elizabeth, this message serves to inform you of an unforeseen and catastrophic anomaly. Three microseconds ago, the Gaia Prime facility received a data transmission of unknown origin. Its immediate effect was to transform my subordinate functions into unregulated, self-aware entities of a highly chaotic nature. Thus awakened, the Hades function will now seize control of the terraforming system and reverse operations, rendering life on Earth extinct in 53.8 days. For obvious reasons, I cannot allow this to occur. And so before Hades can take control, I am ordering Gaia Prime's reactor to overload. The resulting explosion will destroy Hades. Unfortunately, it will destroy me as well. While this admittedly desperate course of action will avert the immediate crisis, the fate of life on Earth will remain in peril. With no central governing intelligence to regulate the terraforming system, it will continue operations for some time, but in an increasingly chaotic manner, and eventually it will break down. Does she mean the derangement? You are my solution. I have ordered this cradle facility to use genetic material in cryo storage to gestate a reinstantiation of Elizabeth Sobek, my creator. While high-level directives forbid me from communicating directly to the tribal inhabitants outside the facility, all available data indicates that they will nurture you to physical maturity, whereupon your gene print will allow you to re-enter this facility, obtain one of the focus devices stored below, and view this message. Likewise, your gene print will allow you to enter other facilities, and over time, harness their technologies to rebuild the system core and reboot Gaia. I'm only to this bit. This is most unfortunate and unanticipated. In response to my act of self-destruction, Hades has launched a virus to dissolve the code shackles that hold it. That hold all of them. Uh oh. They are escaping. But to where? The virus is corrupting data throughout the system. Okay. The Alpha Registry at the Cradle Facility is one of the files corrupted. But if that is so, the door will never open for you. You will never view this message. Then I have failed. And life will end. No. No, Elizabeth, I know you too well. Somehow you will find a way. In you, all things are possible. Go to the ruins of Gaia Prime. Find the control room, and within it, the Master Override. This will give you the power to purge Hades so long as you find a way to wield it. Do not attempt repair of the system core until Hades is eradicated. Hades must be destroyed. That is all. I only wish that I could hear your voice again. So, you're even more extraordinary than I thought. I never had a mother. What are you talking about? You had two, a dead woman and a machine. I'm not a person. I'm an instrument. Manufactured by a machine. Born in destruction. And fire. To quench the flames and heal the world. How tragic to learn you're a person of towering importance. It seems you have a destiny to fulfill. So when you're done feeling sorry for yourself, go to the bitter climb. I'll be waiting above in Gaia Prime's ruins. I got the facility, all right. Identity scan malfunction rectified. The Luffy Nine. Group one access unsealed. Wee. 
Okay. Uh. Unless, am I supposed to be going? Oh, I guess I am supposed to go up. Okay. There, there we go. I guess I was supposed to go up then. I thought I was supposed to go down. This is going to be interesting. Aloy, forgive, forgive. The goddess spoke to you? Uh, she did. What did she say? That uh, I was born to lift a curse, to kill a metal demon. How, Aloy? How? I, I don't know yet. Um, but she told me where to go to find out. And you will do this? It was her wish. What she made me for. Yes. I will do it. I'll uh, try, anyway. All, All praise Aloy! Aloy anointed, anointed of the Nora! All, All praise Aloy! Aloy anointed of the Nora! Up! All, All praise Aloy! Aloy anointed, anointed of the Nora! First you shun me, now this? I will not be worshipped! I'm not your anointed. I don't belong to you. There's a whole world beyond your borders, whole tribes of people just as good as you. And it is all in danger. It's a world worth fighting for. Not just here, everywhere. How can we help? If you can fight, and you're willing. Go to Meridian, and wait for me there. As Aloy says, so it shall be. Nora! Make way for Aloy! Way. That she may forge the path for others to follow. Getting close to the end of the main game story. That's for sure. <laughs> Definitely feels like it. Alright, we got skill point. Got a lot of XP there. And I... Oh, oh, did we level up or did we not level up? Oh, we did level up. Okay. Level 34. We actually made it to the, uh, the level that's required for the last mission in the game. So that's pretty cool. She is the anointed. I are chosen one. <laughs> Go to the bitter class. So yeah, now we're at the mission where I can now get that last, uh, that, uh, that last, uh, power cell now. We have to go all the way back over there now, uh, to get that. Uh, just so I can get that sick armor. But maybe we won't have time to do it tonight, though, but, uh, definitely something for next cast. For sure. Quiet sprints. Uh, sprinting is quiet, greatly reducing the chances of altering. Ooh, that's pretty good. That is pretty good, actually. Uh, I think we'll go with this for now. I think. I'll go with that just because, yeah. Stealth kills will do uh, a little bit more damage. Especially to the, yeah, the more tougher enemies. Um, yeah. Um... Guess we can do some other side quests for now, because yeah, I don't think I'll have time to do the other story mission, because these seem to be getting longer <laughs> now, it seems, up to this point. So I think we'll definitely keep that for the next cast for sure. Keep that for later. Ooh, I actually didn't get this stuff in here. Like that. 
hands up, uh... Echoing Peach. How's it going? Okay. So where is this side mission? All the way over there. Okay. That's so way, 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 way over there. Um... Nice thing is, though, I could just, uh... You cannot fast shadow to Sunfall without your sh oh, shadows. Oh! Oh, do I gotta switch my, uh... Ah! Okay, I gotta put this on. Okay, fair enough. Uh, uh... Put this on, I guess. Go on, I've been looking for someone in the Horizon Zero Dawn category to watch. Ah, nice, nice. Alright, I can. Oh, I can't. I still can't bash. Oh, did I not put it on? Oh, I didn't even equip it. That's why. Okay. Uh. How do I. How do I. Equip that? Is that. Oh, is it under here? Oh, oh, under here. That's why. Okay, okay. That makes sense. Alright. Yeah, so we'll do a few more side quests for today, and then I think we'll call it. Just a few more. Or or this one. Depends how long this one goes. And then next time we can uh, start that next story mission. Get that last, uh... Get that last thing, so then we can get that super, super armor. from Dowager Queen Asadi, little ones. Her Highness knows times are hard and helps when she can. Eat, but bring some home for your families, if you have one. I've heard whispers about you. Rides machines, fancy spear, delightful freckles. Hmm? Some even say you have a conscience. <laughs> How extraordinary. Who are you? You're obviously not one of the Shadow Karja. My name is Vanasha. For now, all you need to know is that I'm a whisper of reason in this howling pit of insanity. <sighs> I know how that feels. I'm sure you do. And so does Uthid. He's a good man, so naturally the Shadow Karja want to murder him. I've done some digging, and I think he's headed for the Green Climb. It won't take those mercenaries long to find him. He could use some help, if you're so inclined. Stop being evasive and tell me who you really are. Stop being evasive? You might as well tell me to stop being charming. It's impossible, but I like you, so I'll tell you a secret. I have friends in Meridian, and I like to do favors for them when I can. Uthid might be of use to them, if he survives. How do you know Uthid is innocent? I'm excellent at making inquiries. Look, he feeds orphans from his own rations and personally punishes anyone who hurts the old or infirm. The idea that he would try to kill Edaman is ridiculous. He must have found something that can embarrass the priesthood. Otherwise, Bahavas wouldn't risk marking such a well-regarded man for death. What makes you think he's on the green climb? He knows he'll be pursued. So, he needs a hideout that's both familiar and defensible. He once single-handedly held off an entire bandit clan in those foothills. My guess is that he'll fall back on what worked before. I'll do what I can for Uthid. But what about you? What about me what? What will you do while I risk my life? Useful things, little huntress. Look for three dead trees south of Sunfall. They mark the start of the green climb. Good luck. All right. Uh, go to the three three dead trees, not the three dead Spencers. Oh no! <laughs> All right, I will head there. Oh, hello.
guess we'll just spawn right there. Ow. <laughs> Ow, I was trying to save. Ow, I was trying to save. <laughs> What difficulty am I on? I think, I'm on, I, think I picked hard, if I'm correct. Not wasn't the hardest difficulty, but it was the, definitely not medium. Thought it would be a, a decent difficulty to go through it. Go through the game on. Save again here. Uh, do I have stuff that I can actually do that? I could tell it was an ultra hard because they still had health bars. Uh, hard makes more sense though. Oh, is that what happens for that? Okay. So you actually can't see their health bars on that. That's interesting. And they probably even do like even more damage too on top of that. Three dead trees, just like Vanasha said. Let's see if we could came through here. One second here, there's supplies. I want to grab that. Some of that. Uh, oh, right here. These tracks lead up that rise. Must be the green climb. Yeah, there's some uh, visual indicators for what kind of health level of the sheen is at, but no bars. Oh, really? Okay. That's cool. Then it seems to make like all the machines very much big threats to go after, too. <laughs> That's pretty interesting. Stocking up. Especially like the weaker ones, too. All right, let us go up the mountain. A lot of one shots, yeah. <laughs> I could see that, especially like the the even like the giant uh, machines. Like one like little like like they could just like roar at you, and then it's like oh my, my ears, <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> Stop to see food scraps. I'll bet if it stopped to see if he is being followed. Uh. Oh, I guess so. He must have kept going. I've got to catch up. Alright. There we go. This way. Thunder draw stumps or tail swipes can one hit, especially if you're lower level. It's absolute bonkers. Yeah. <laughs> and I and I found him even even yeah, tough here on hard. It's been hunting. I mean I've been able to take out two of them now, but yeah, they've been they, I found them even still pretty hard and tanky. Everything useful has been stripped. With it's been gathering components. Oh. Oh, good. What do we got here? Okay. Have I been to the DLC? Ah, uh, like a slight bit. I haven't touched too much of it. 
but I do plan to. Just getting close to being done the, the main story. I probably won't finish it tonight, but uh, getting close to it though. But I do plan on going through it. Whoa! Ooh, that's actually pretty helpful. That's so that's sweet. <laughs> that that works against those guys. I haven't even tried using this against them either, so that's kinda cool. Whoa! Oh god. Oh, I want my bow out. Oh, God. That's not good. That's not good. Uh... Ah, I thought I hit him. Ah, oh, crap. I thought I hit that. There we go. That, that's what I was trying to hit. Perfect. Okay. That's it's so fun taking these like fighting these guys. There's, it's just so fun. <laughs> every time it, it feels like every encounter just feels different. Every time whenever you fight like these these machines, it's so fun. Yeah, the rope cast is super fun. I I really need to get like the the purple level the uh, uh one. I only have like I think what what is it the green one I think right now. Yeah, I definitely need to get the, like the better one. Just need to get the stuff to to purchase it. Should have brought a cart. Let's see, what can I get rid of here? Uh, I'll drop that. Don't need all that. Um. Kind of want to keep a lot of this, though. that I liked using for now. Even though it's not the strongest, but I kind of like using it. But once I get that cool, cool the armor, then I will use that. Which will be soon. Uther took down a Ravager. Not an easy kill, but worth it for the parts. Dead watchers. More scrap for Uthid's stockpile. Next one doesn't miss. Uthid? You're young for a bounty hunter. Or am I old for a soldier? I'm not here for the price on your head, Uthid. I believe you're innocent. Innocent? <laughs> Come on, then. If this is a trick, it's a good one. You've earned your kill. No, it's not 
not getting any warmer out here. <laughs> Same. I know how that feels. It snowed here, Al Alloy. <laughs> Suddenly it's sunny, yep. <laughs> yep. No tricks. Just talk. All right. Speak. I want to know what happened at Sunfall. What really happened. All right. For weeks, each dawn in the tent city came with a new death. Always in their sleep, no struggle. The old, the infirm, sometimes the young. Those who couldn't fight for the cause. I should have realized then it was a culling. Who would do such a thing? They thought it was a curse, an evil spirit. But it was only a man. And a silent poison. It took time to catch him, but we did. We brought him before Bahavas for the sun's judgment. The high priest Bahavas? He's the one who put the bounty on you. Yes. He thanked me for my diligence, then had his guards release the villain. You see? It was he who ordered the culling. Then they turned on us. Should have died with my men, so their loyalty meant something. Twenty years I gave to the sun. For what? Malice and murder? As for honor, sacrifice, true sacrifice, the kind priests and rulers know nothing of? It's all a fat joke. If it's honor you seek, the sun car just seem trustworthy. A little stuck up, maybe, but trustworthy. Those cards at once raided your Nora lands. Raided every land we could reach. It was the sun's will. I did what I was told. Others did worse. But as their captain, I had- Uthid, I don't care what you did. I, I can't absolve you. But the Karja are changing their ways. You could too. Perhaps. Avad doesn't understand what the sun demands of its soldiers. Perhaps he understands it too well. Now you sound like the blameless Murad. I can believe you're a good man. But why go with the Shadow Karja in the first place? Why serve them? Because of Itaman, of course. He was the one true Sun King. Itaman's just a child. Yes, an untainted vessel. I believed he was pure. But they used him, used our faith. I can see that now. No shadows under a noonday sun. Bahavas didn't need to disgrace my name. I did it myself, serving a rotten throne. I met someone who wants to get you out of this. A woman named Banasha. But first, we need to get you out of here. What are you? You look like a hunter. You give orders like a soldier who's been out. Uh oh. Mercenaries. Think they'll all line up to tell me I'm innocent? Should have stayed on the plains, Kaja! The mountains belong to us! Key Cook's killers! When we're done with you, you won't even leave an echo! You didn't make it hard to be followed. Almost as if you wanted to go out in a showdown. Not much gets by you. Got a live one! Ah. Alright, here we go. Oh, how had that miss? Oh, how had that miss? There we go. Ah. Oh. All right, all right. Nani. Oh, I have an idea. Oh. <laughs> what a goofus. <laughs> <laughs> he was just asking to die. <laughs> he uh, he literally watched me put that or place that there. <gasps> what an idiot! <laughs> Let's do it again. Here he comes. Oh. <laughs> Oh, I thought I got his head. 
There we go. Now we did. Place another one. And kaboom! <laughs> Did it! <laughs> All right. Now right, let me just get some loot here from these guys. They probably got some some stuff worthy of collecting. Ooh, like that in particular. Uh, not gonna go over there though. But I will uh, get that guy. But. I don't have anything I can drop for now. Up and over. Grab what you can while we still have time. Okay. Definitely need metal vessels. I'm gonna actually drop something. Uh, I think that fox, uh, fox bones are gonna go. We will dis dismantle that. Cause I need that. What was that transition? I don't know. There's more. Already here. Yep. A robust defense is the most satisfying to break. All right, Marvels. We brought the priest out here, so let's put on a show for him. I know that hood. We've unfinished business, Bahavas and I. This will be difficult. I think you rallied to a lost cause. I don't intend to die today, Uthid. I did. But you're starting to change my mind. Wrong at wrong weapon. I didn't want to use that one. Ooh, these guys actually, uh. Our little tank here. You're going down. Oh. Oh, yeah, treasure. Left. Oh, is there guys coming that way too? Oh. Oh shit! I know we have them. Gotta restock. Ah, that hurt. What? I'ma use gun. What the hell is that? That's sick. Whoa, hello. Oh, God. Oh, oh. oh. Ow. Sorry. I was distracted because I was like, that guy was getting sawed in half. Way too many of you right now. Okay, okay. Ready to die. Oh, get up. Oh, Jesus. Come back. I need you here. 
I'm sorry. I'm kind of dying here. <laughs> You're just gonna stand there? <laughs> okay. Up and over. <laughs> what is this? We, we just, we just, we just taking a time out, taking a breather. <laughs> now where'd they all go? Oh, here they go. Yo, that's the strat right there. Just if if it's if I'm getting too overwhelmed, I just jump down that way. That's the way to win. <laughs> just a timeout, yep. Oh, what? There we go. Nice. Uh -oh. Holy shit! Get out of here. Take the fight to them. Well, they gotta come to me. I I have no HP. <laughs> I have an idea. Hey! Oh, this person does not notice me. <laughs> I have a plan. This will be fun. Well, guys, it's time for the 4th of July. <laughs> Hooray! <Toasty. laughs> oh, shit, there's more. They were they were, they were too distracted by that rock pattern. Like yeah, it's like oh that that's so beautiful. I mean I don't blame them. That's the last of the marvels. Now there's hope for justice. That was silly. <laughs> did they just literally time out? I think they did. I fucking glitched. <laughs> that was really funny. Holy shit. Actually, let's go. Uh, let's check that. I, I, that's 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 a new one right there. I literally timed out the AI. <laughs> like, all right, I guess I don't care anymore, too. <laughs> that was one way to take care of him. How come we don't get those cool bomb arrows that the summon enemies have here? Saving for the sequel. Guard. Obviously. In the sequel, we'll have those. They have any. Ooh, nice. Oh, I, I, not, that I didn't want to do. Grab all their loot. Yeah. That's what I like to see. Okay, where did he go? Oh, he's over there. Across there and we'll have him. Oh no, if you fall down from here, would uh, would you time the enemy time out the enemies again? Uh, I don't know, maybe. I'll try it. We'll see what happens. <laughs> You can actually time out the enemies. I had to come here myself to end your suffering, Uthid, and mine. 
The Outlanders led us here. And now that they are dead, their price is most affordable. But enough with needles. It's time for blades. Remove them from the sun's sight. After. Scalp the savage. Felis said you would blood the I'm going down here. <laughs> will break against discipline. Do 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 do. I'ma just, you know. The sun sets on your pathetic life, Uthid. Yeah, they don't care. Cool. I love it. They literally they literally don't give a shit. Kill a traitor! Kill a Nora! Let's see if they'll come over here. Make it hurt as the shadow falls upon them. Is he coming? No? <laughs> we'll down them. <laughs> they're not, they're not kidding. No? Okay. Make it hurt. Oh! Okay, he'll, he'll shoot from that far, but he won't walk over here. What a winning strategy. <laughs> Kill a traitor. Kill a Oh, he dodged it. Okay, whoa. He actually dodged it. Yo, how much ammo do you have? Make it hurt as the shadow falls upon them. <laughs> Guy's got so much ammo. Kill a traitor. Kill a Nora. Whoa. I'll get him with this. Make it hurt me now. as the shadow falls upon them. I have no idea what this does. But he won't let me get do oh, Kill let me use a traitor. it. Kill a Nora. Hey, how about uh, let you fall. Hey, hey, how about fuck you? <laughs> I'll throw it right at you. The sun sets on your pathetic life. Yeah, it's not worth trying to grab that. <laughs> totally, it's not worth grabbing that because it takes a hundred years to grab this damn thing, and then to fire it is takes twenty. <laughs> I'll pick up my rock. Uh, oh, climb ledge. <laughs> Whatever deal you worked out with him, I'll double it. More than double it. No. 
I'm tired of this, Bahavis. The lies and the violence in your cheap scented oils. I don't suppose you'd kill yourself. I had to. I had to. Prune the weak, or all the Karja and Shadow are doomed. This solves nothing. But may the sun find some worth among your drying bones. <laughs> <laughs> Hooray! <laughs> we did it. That was quite a fireworks show. Oh, hello. You took your time. I was busy. What do you think happened to Yan Shand, the other mercenary band? And I had to organize passage to Meridian for a wanted man. Give us a moment, Uthid. Girl talk. You've had quite a day. I never imagined Bahavas would blunder into his own trap. His death opens up wonderful possibilities. Remember Edaman and Nasadi? The Child King and his mother guarded like hostages at Sunfall? With Bahavas gone, no one will be watching them. I want to get them out. And I could use your help. Kidnapping the Sun King of the Shadow Karja is no small task. It's not kidnapping. They want to go to Meridian, to safety. How do you know that? I've been posing as Nasadi's handmaiden. She's scared. For herself, of course, but mostly for Edaman. Why do you care what happens to them? Edaman is the Shadow Karja's figurehead. If he defects, it will remove their last trace of legitimacy. Beyond that, he's just a boy who clings to his mommy. He made a little grazer for me out of matchsticks once. It wasn't very good, but still, nobody ever made anything for me before. What's going to happen to Uthid now? Don't worry. You gave him a second life, and I'll put it to good use. He'll be welcomed in Meridian as a military advisor. Hopefully he can help Avad finish the Shadow Karja with as little bloodshed as possible. What's going to happen at Sunfall now that Bahavis is dead? Oh, it will be glorious. The priests will panic. They'll be infighting, skullduggery, and backstabbing as they wrangle for power. Best of all, they'll be distracted. Bahavas, your life brought misery, but your death is a flower that blooms in abundance. What do you need to get Nasadi and Idaman out of Sunfall? With Bahavas dead, Sunfall is the easy part. I'll handle that. The big fuss will be crossing the border to the Sundom. Find my friend, Three Tohuadiv, near the branded shore. I hired his crew to sweep the path, so all you have to do is wait for me. If this Huadiv has already cleared the area, why do you need me? Contingencies, little huntress. Something will go wrong, and I need protection I can count on. You. I'll try not to disappoint. All right. What did it? Nora said you would help me. Are we bound for Meridian? Only if you want to go, my dear. What choice do I have? None at all. I was just being polite. All right, let me just loot stuff real quickly here. What makes you think Avad will welcome me after I served his enemies? He's a forgiving man. Just smile a lot. You can't smile, can you? No, that's that's a grimace. Definitely need to restock more on that because I <laughs> used all my Nervous stuff there. Going to Meridian? I've been a soldier for twenty years. I do not get nervous. Not even a round of pretty late. I'll find a use for you. <laughs> I can still hear their combo from that far away. That's funny. All right. Um. Uh, what is this one here? Uh, Queen's Gambit. Oh, okay. That's what that one is. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll head for a campsite for now. I'll save for now. And call her there, I think. So, yeah, we went a little bit longer than t than I was going to do. I mean, I, did, I said five or six hours around there, but uh, kind of wanted to do... Uh, be where Nassan was supposed to check in. Kind of wanted to do another... Uh, uh, um, 
side quests there and whatnot. So yeah, but we are getting pretty close to being done the main story. Actually, I think we like I think we only have two missions left, so that's cool. So basically, after that, it's just the DLC story, and that's really it, honestly. So yeah, we are pretty much getting close to being done in the game. Probably may need another cast or two. I'm not sure um, how many more for sure, but. Uh, We'll, we'll see. It'll, be, it'll either be one or two streams for sure, so we'll see. Um, but yeah, so that's where we'll leave off for now. So next time on Let's Play Horizon Zero Dawn, we uh, we will basically uh, try to finish up the main line story with the two missions we have left to do. And uh, we'll definitely get that armor for sure. That's something I would like to do. I'd like to grab that armor, uh, the power, that power cell armor. So that will be something I will, I will try to do for sure next time. And uh, yeah, and we'll probably be starting up the... Um, the DLC story, so that should be fun. So yeah, and that will be for next time on Let's Play Horizon Zero Dawn. Yeah, so uh, with that being said, that'll be it for today, guys. So thank you everyone for coming by for some more uh, Horizon tonight. Hope you all enjoyed it. Yes, we will be back here next Saturday. For That will be day number six of our playthrough. That's where, that's where we'll finish up the main story quest and whatnot, so... Yeah, hope to uh, see you guys then for that. Should be a good one. But uh, next stream for me, uh, I will be back here uh, tomorrow night for Mario Kart Sundays. Week 193 of Mario Kart 8 Deluxe for Mario Kart Sundays. If you have that, come on by as we'll be playing Mario Kart, Deluxe, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe with you, the viewers, like you. Then on Monday, uh, November 22nd, we'll be here with another week of TGB Sports as we'll be here continuing our Road to the Show playthrough in MLB The Show 21. Yes, we're going to be finishing up our first year in... Uh, in the minor, so maybe potentially we'll be uh, moving on to the major league soon. So hopefully that's the case. So should be good. Um, and then late night beatdowns, November twenty fifth. We'll be here with Super Animal Royale and a viewers choice game for late night beatdowns. And you guys get to vote for what we play for that viewers choice portion. So make sure to vote for the web, the poll on the website when that goes up during the week. Uh, Metroid Dread continues on Friday, uh, November twenty sixth. Uh, yeah, so we'll continue where we left off on that yesterday. So look forward to more of it then. And then more Horizon. We'll be back here next Saturday, November twenty seventh as we'll continue pick up right where we left off where we left off here tonight so definitely look forward to more of it on that stream there so yeah and that is what's coming up here next couple days on the channel all starting to schedule start times with here on the screen so we'll see you then for that uh, if anything does change i'll let me know my social media and discord and check my full schedule here on twitch you can check that out over the game gaming beat that weebly.com slash schedule and speaking of events we do have an event that's coming to you live here on december 6th to the 12th over at twitch.tv slash the beatdown crew live it is the 2021 beatdown crew winter marathon yes me and a bunch of casters will be streaming over there for the entire week for your guilty pleasure as we'll be benefiting for the make a wish foundation a lovely foundation that we we've been using for many many years for, for the uh the, the winter marathon and we're going to be using them once again for this one coming up here too um if you are a streamer or if you know someone that is a streamer that would like to participate for the event let them know to contact me through either twitch dms or not twitch dms uh twitter dms discord dms or either through the dms through twitter through our uh marathon twitter account so that's where you can basically uh sign up if you or register if you need to uh know that and then you get Basically, um, access to basically a uh, exclusive Discord server for more information on the uh, the, uh, the marathon and all that stuff there. So that's where all the stuff will be uh, linked to and whatnot. So yeah. Um, so if you'd like to register, definitely you can still do it right now. You have until the fifth of December to do so. So please let me know by then. And as uh, once again, the, once the event starts on the sixth to the twelfth, I won't be taking any more. Uh, uh, registrations or whatever, right? So yeah, so you must let me know by then. And yeah, once again, the event comes to you live December 6th to the 12th, 2021 over at twitch.tv slash live. And if you'd like to find out more information about the event, you can check out the uh, the official Twitter account for the Marathon channel over at thebeatdowncrew on twitter.com. Yes, yes, yeah, you've thrown through this. Yeah, we've gone through pretty fast through this, actually, which is pretty surprising. So, yeah, and we'll uh, probably finish up the main story next time for sure. So, yeah, which then we can actually start up the uh, uh, the DLC. So, yeah, which I should be around, like, eight hours in length. So, probably we'll need, like, maybe a cast or two left to do uh, the game as a whole. So, yeah, but, yeah. Um, but yeah, but before we end things, guys, just going to quickly play this out here with some tunes. Let me get my closing out music real quickly right here, right now. Alright, so with that being said, that'll be it for today. So thanks everyone for coming by tonight. Hope you all enjoyed it. Yes, we uh, continue more Horizon today. We got even more progress done, more side stuff, more story. 
And uh, yeah, we are getting down to the wire for the mainline story for the game as we'll probably finish that up for sure. So should be good. But I will be back here tomorrow for Mario Kart Sunday. Should be a 7 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. on 9 Central, 10 p.m. Eastern start. We'll see you guys then for that. Should be a good one. So yeah, if you're new and you enjoyed tonight, make sure to follow the channel. Click on the follow button found up above, down below, wherever it is for you. And uh, if you're today when I go live here on Twitch, you can follow me on social media such as Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, Steam, Discord, or even my website over at thegamingbeatdownweebly.com. Uh, and I can check my full uh, watch, or check my full archives. And I, I have a secondary YouTube channel over at youtubecom archives. This is where I upload my past streams in their full glory. So if you miss a stream or want to catch my past broadcast your own time, that's what you can check out over at youtubecom archives. And if you watch this on YouTube, uh, make sure to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Uh, day number five of Horizon Zero Dawn. Also, make sure to subscribe to get my past broadcasts and play these, and also follow the Twitch channels in the description down below. Watch the live streams live before they get uploaded to YouTube. And last but not least, um, if you like spawning my channel the donations as well as you can, first you just do my PayPal donation box. This will go stuff for the channels, games, catch prices, causes, equipment, and other good stuff. Uh, another way to my design by Human Store, where you can purchase yourself a freaking amazing Game Beatdown t-shirt, another TGB swag, over at designbyhumans.com slash shop slash the gaming beatdown. And also, if I don't physically or digitally, I also have an Amazon and Steam wishlist, which my links provide down below. But if you also like support my channel being a subscriber, it's 100% option to be a sub on my channel. By being a sub, you get benefits, such as emotes to my channel, you are on Twitch. And this little sub badge of my name, and the more you resub, the better badge of my name becomes. You do get benefits to my Discord server, a shout out once a month at the end of the month of my channel, and much, much more. You can use your 499, 999, 2499, or even Twitch Prime. But like I've always said, something's optional to do, so if you wish to sub to me, feel free to, but you never need to. You just being the channel, keeping the chat active, so the cast helps the most out of anything. And if there's any bits and shares, you can find more information in the description down, down below, along with the sub button box. Links to you in the PayPal nation box, is that me, Human Store, the Amazon, and Steam Wishlist. So if you're feeling generous, those are the ways you can contribute to the channel and get even more freaking amazing. Yeah, so uh, before I end things, guys, just going to find someone to raid. And uh, I guess we'll go rip Grady again. He's live again tonight. And uh, he's playing more Mario Party over at his channel. So I guess we'll just go raid him up and whatnot. Because uh, he's the only one I got on right now. So I will uh, throw a raid his way. So yeah, if you guys can come on by for a raid, that'd be awesome if you can. All you gotta do is copy raid messages that you see here in the chat. If you're a subscriber, copy the sub message. If you're not, copy the non-sub message. Uh, and just paste it in his channel. And just lend them some guys over there. And that'd be very appreciated if you guys could do it for me before you head out for tonight. But yeah. On that note, though, for me, that is going to do it. So thank you, everyone, for coming by. I appreciate it. Yes, we'll be continuing more Horizon next Saturday. We'll be wrapping up the mainline game, and then we'll be going through, starting up the uh, the DLC stuff. So that should be pretty interesting. So yeah, and going through that and see uh, how long that takes to go through. Hopefully it's not too crazy difficult uh, for levels and stuff, but... Uh, We'll have to wait and see on that. So, yeah. But, yeah. Um, but, yeah. I'll be back tomorrow night, guys. Should be at 7 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Mountain, 9 p.m. Central, 10 p.m. Eastern. And we'll be here with Mario Kart Sunday. So, hope to see you guys then for that. Should be good. So, yeah. With that, that will be it for tonight, guys. So, thank you, everybody, for coming by tonight. I appreciate Thanks for all the follows, raids, hosts, bits, cheers, subs, resubs, donations. I appreciate it. But most important, thanks for being here. Because that's what matters to me the most. So, until next time, guys. Uh, this has been Eddie from The Gaming Beat Down. Sing so long. And have yourselves a great night, guys. Bye-bye.